So, uh, yeah, everybody, welcome to Matchstick Melee. It's Tekken time. Still waiting to hear from one of our competitors, but no time like the present to get going. Oh, nope, Trinity, sorry, you're not competing, you're just commentating. It's uh, Cracker Jack Joe and, and Jay Digga. Medic, what up, buddy? Oh, my God. There we go. Oh, oh, medic just signed up. Oh, jeez. Oh, god. Oh. Okay, that actually doesn't affect anything. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, medic, you might get a first round buy. Something happened. I don't like it. Get ready for the next battle. battle, battle, battle. I'm not sure who's actually playing. Uh, let's see. Great invite. Copy. You know, we're we're just getting you know technical hitches. Why are you playing? Because uh, Tekken 7 is a mystery of a game. Don't worry. All, I have to do, all you have to do is lose real quick. Just let... Uh, just let uh, Cracker beat you up. So you said about me? Hello. When you said lose real quick, are you talking about me? Yeah, just go, just go ahead and lose real quick. Okay. <laughs> Hey, hey, I'm taking the punches like that. Just, that just, just take the take the punchies. There you go. You know what? That shit hurt. You saw you have to roll up. Wait, is that unblockable? What the death fist? No, not at yeah. all. I wasn't pressing buttons. That's clearly unblockable. Oh, okay. Well, maybe it's a maybe it's a better yeah, death fist. See? There you go. Okay. Round three. And then he had a move that knocks you off the board. Oh yeah, if, if you're if you're so add the commentary as as the commentator, the co-commentator, Storm Queen, if uh There you go. Um if your name comes up and it's not your turn, you gotta mash on that R1 button on your uh PlayStation controller, and it'll skip you. It's a horrible, it's a horrible, horrible system, but it's the best we've got. No, I mean, I'm, I'm glad that now I know that because <laughs> at first I didn't. I thought that it was just you have to wait the what 15 seconds to hit you. Uh, it's it's I, I've yeah. Th this whole thing is just perplexing and I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> but Bamco lobbies are the stuff of nightmares. It's a lot. Well, I think uh, you said Namco. I thought about. At first, I wasn't going to take it. It was good, but he said, Damn, Co. Mm -hmm. They just put me mindset of Soul Calibur, the Wildfighter, and I'm like, Oh, you can't know this. They're the shit they want to serve. They're the shit. Storm, can I get you a little closer to your mic? Or, or just, just have you eat it? <laughs> Hi. There we go. Yeah, That's a little better. Hey, turn up. What's up? I love you, my man. We'll, yeah, we'll I got you. With a fifty percent boost in Discord gain, or yeah, uh, volume as well. Okay. I can just put my head, my gaming headphones. Headphones I make the dream that. work. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thankfully, there's lots of time to type out uh, timestamps while. Tekken figures out if it's a game or not. Okay, can you guys see me now? That that's way better. Yes. Okay, I have to move it to my my, my face. Yeah, I have my own. Um... Okay, here we go. So we got J Digger on the left versus Cracker Jack on the right. Ooh. Aren't you Cracker Jack, Jack Joe? No, not me. I don't play. Really? Wait, <laughs> I'm gonna look in this, this, this Discord to see who I'm talking to because I does not know. Oh, you're matchstick. I'm matchstick, yeah. 
Oh, I thought she was cracking down. I'm, I'm, I'm the titular matchstick. This is my melee. Welcome to it. <laughs> so, shit, turn up. Thank you for inviting me. Hey, I'm definitely for here for it. All the time. That's, that's who I am, you know? The community only thrives off the community. And when I saw a post, I'm like, you know, we got to show love to each other. That's, that's what this is all about. Especially if we all play the same thing. Why can't we show love and spread vibes, especially exactly. now during this pandemic? Exactly. So JD got off to a pretty good start. His, uh, his Gigas ain't messing around. He got that perfect last round. Throwing Cracker Jack yeah, around like a rag doll. Oh. Speaking of good throws, though. Oh, all right. Rage Drive? Oh, no, Rage Art. That's right. Rage Art's the, the big cinematic. This is the first time I've ever seen a high-ranked Gigas player. Oh, they, they are all over the place, like, out here. We have a guy named uh, Iron Zangif, who... Uh, he will he will walk on you <laughs> so do i press r1 now yeah exactly if it's yeah so all these are two out of three um so until the two out of three goes through we gotta mash that r1 button gosh 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 <laughs> gosh cracker jack going off in the chat who plays gigas <laughs> nobody that too I never see Gigas like being played like ever. So oh, when I just saw yeah. it, I was kind of shocked. That's that lack of matchup knowledge that, that leads to people's downfall. Well, it's taking forever to cycle through people. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait, no. Jay Digga got out of the way. Wait, mm. Okay, there we go. All right, they're back. <laughs> oh, this stuff. It says Cracker Jack Joe oh. versus Jay Digger 97, but yeah, Jay Digger didn't press it. the button. Actually, what happened? The level lobby stuff is coming back up for me? Never mind. Okay, yeah. Again, yeah. Namco, Nam Namco Online, baby. It's, uh, <laughs> it's a weird, wild creature. <laughs> So, uh, Storm, tell us a little about yourself. Oh, wow. I was so not ready for that. That is just this interview. <laughs> but I so, like I put on a spot. Well, uh, uh, uh. How about this? Okay. What, uh, um, how long have you been playing Tekken? Wow. Um, it depends on what you mean by play tech. Like, you mean pressing buttons on any Tekken game or actually like, isn't, understanding what's isn't like, happening? Just, isn't that just what it is? <laughs> I mean, they can, they, can talk about, buttons. they can talk about their frames and whatever, but I think a lot of these guys are just making it up. <laughs> facts, facts, <laughs> facts. Because, like, before we had internet, everybody had their own terminology of, they, what, of what they use for the advanced techniques in any fighting game. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of hard, when, especially for me, going into people say, oh, I have frame advantage or a hit stun. Well, I could understand hit stun. Hit stun should be like, you know, universal, you know, when you get hit, you're stunned. Right, right. But like frame advantage or plus one block, negative, that, that confused me. Like, I was like, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, yeah. Plus one it's, block? it's a bit of a thing to learn. The, plus the notation is uh, different between N Namco's like, two longest running titles, Soul Caliber and, uh, and Tekken. So, you know, in some you're like, okay, 6-6-A six, six, or versus, you know, like, what? 3-1? What, what's going on here? Like, down 4-1? or Yeah, it's... I mean, I just understood that. I mean, I've been in this lifestyle too long. Because mm -hmm. at first I was like, where are these numbers coming from? Because I do notation yep. when, I, when I was in the chess team. Like, I play oh, chess, so there you go. definitely notation. Oh, nice grab. Got the KO. Okay, Cracker Jack. I'm sorry about that. No, okay, so I've been pressing buttons since I was introduced to Tekken um, in Tekken 2 back when PlayStation was releasing the demo disc. Oh. And they had, uh, so, who so was you, the main you, two? You I think it was yours, John. You, you got yours with a, with a Pizza Hut order? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Oh, no. Nah, this, 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 this was back in the day when we had Game Pro. And Game Pro oh. had the, uh, the disc uh, inside the packages at, like, Walgreens. Like, when you buy the... Uh, 
the actual um I almost call it the comic, the magazine. And it'll come with where you, you can sign um the postcard to start your own subscription and it'll come with a demo disc. And it has that Tobal uh Tobal one or Tobal two. Yep. Yeah, that uh Crash Bandicoot, uh Blast Blast Radius. Oh, that's what the name of the game, Blast Radius. <laughs> I have to get that. The game was so fun. So and when I picked it up, the first character I saw, I, I'm a feminist, so I believe that, you know, females can fight just the strongest guys. Yeah, and Jun yeah. was like the very first person I touched and it was just over. So it kind of hurt my feelings when it was like, yeah, she died in Tekken Tag too, so I'm not gonna see her in this. I'm like, what? Mm-hmm. That, that, that's, that's Bay. like that's, that's, that's where it started. But me and my roommate been playing for years now, like he was always the Tekken fighter. I stayed in Marvel, like only three, three fights I played was Soul Calibur. And I understood that because I like weapons in real life. But when it came to like understanding the range of your actual body body, like your fist and your legs, that was hard. And then sidestepping and shit, yeah, it was like really hard. So like, I'm really here for the experience. Crackerjack really needed to sidestep that because he's kind of getting mauled by this gigas. Oh, and there it goes. This is exactly why I'm not trying to be a part of this right now. I just want to smoke (laughs) and just be okay with life. Well that's a nice thought but unfortunately you're up next against who uh you're gonna be fighting subway wang oh well, i'm here hi subway wang let's get so it let's get him in here trey you in the middle of a game there he is are you in the middle of a game you want to spend while I'm uh, waiting on my turn for this tournament? I'm in the stream. All right, there you go. Jay Digga with that 2 0 over Cracker Jack. Uh, Cracker Jack going down to losers. Um, we have not heard from from Under Man, so I'm just going to DQ him. Yeah, I will. At least in the loser bracket, I'm going to take it from there. <sighs> oh, yeah, I put the piece on before I started the. Uh... The tournament. Did you hear the light? Guys, y'all need to stop, alright? <coughs> um, um, hmm. There. Guess what? <laughs> I do not see it. I so you might as well get you as I show me. Yeah. I'm not sure what's, uh. Come on, Subway. Subway, let's get it. Where you yeah, at? I'm ready to throw these hands. We got, uh, we're gonna have to kick J Dig, I think. Why? J Dig cool. No, he's cool. Just, he's, uh, he's just gonna be one more person we have to pass up with this horrible net code. Uh, well, I'm grateful that y'all did it for me, so I was just saying, like, you know, I, I'll do it for somebody else. We, you know, you know we, we, we comrades right now, brothers in arms, sisters in arms. By the way, I heard another feminine voice in here earlier, and I, I wanted to speak, and yeah, well, hell yeah. I, Definitely you, hard day. I never me. forget a thing. You might hurt my cat I was like, meow at me, but that's about it. No, unless your cat is meowth and can speak the human language. She could nah. be. Oh, then you must give me your cat. She certainly meow. doesn't know all of her moves. So she <laughs> must know the English language. Bruh. If Pokemon, if Pokemon was real, there would be no need for government. <laughs> there would be no need for utilities. There would be a huge There'd be no need for, for a lot of stuff. You'd have to regulate the crap out of that. Man, you, you can't regulate something that. What if they? What if somebody just trained their shit to be like super mega level as you would never see them? They just say, "Hey, I'm ready to take over the world now because y'all Pokemon ain't strong as man." So what you gonna do about it? I don't know. I think. Uh... I, th- I think when you have weaponized animals, you really gotta have some sort of oversight body to take care of that. Didn't they have a government Pokemon? I stopped watching that. They, after they like... had a local police force, but like you almost never saw anybody. <laughs> Officer Jenny. Yeah, well, the Officer Jennies. Remember, there, there were a bunch. Right, of which is really creepy. They, and they and there's joys like were all like triplets and, and cousins and and triplets. It's yeah. like. I, know, I don't know what the word to make it because it's like fifty of them. It was I some. Know. It was an officer Jenny and the Nurse <laughs> Joy in po- every Pokemon, town. Pokemon is probably like uh, like the the Pokemon League actually just has like clones of Jenny and Joy like sitting around to deploy to like all their facilities and stuff. Yeah, this you, new you this new region just opened up. 
Can't tell um, me, uh, we need a new one. A company with that much power doesn't uh, doesn't do as they please. Shh, we're not supposed to know. Mm. Yeah, we were really missing Subway Wang at the moment. I wonder where he is. He checked in and everything. Um, I saw him. Um, I checked in too, but I was making yeah. pizza and rolling up splits and blunt to. Well, we can try a different, uh... oh, nope, there he is, of course. The moment I give up is the moment that he pops in. Okay, so this will be uh, this will be your first fight. Uh... I'm finna start my matches, so are you, are you in the middle of a match right now? So yeah, Darkstorm Queen, AKA Cyber Trinity versus Subway Wang. It's gonna be another match. Happening right now. Uh, where's my controller? Oh, that's not a good thing to ask. <laughs> No, because I wasn't in there. I was in my roommate's room. But now know that since we're still smoking, I'm in the middle of a match. Okay, now how am I gonna do this? Cause I need to hear. I need to hear everything. Like I need to be a part of this match. Cause I don't know this person, so how yeah, I uh, fight, I have to he's feel. He's probably that. gonna be playing Leo. Oh, well, Leo. Mm -hmm. I still don't know a lot about everything in this game. But how I fight, I fight the energies that the person who's playing the character gives to me okay well like i, I said i'm I not a master used raven. To it. i know as a master raven you have a lot of work to do because she does not have the the greatest amount of damage output but uh you catch catch people in the, in the heavy strings and you can get them all the way across the board and up against the wall yeah i don't have heavy strings i just have tons of like like i said counter maneuvers to 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 see how somebody thinks mm -hmm. i can't put out damage not yet i need to practice that but how I fight, what my practice is, if I don't have nobody to play with, I'm not gonna touch the game. Like, I really ain't, like, I'm not. Well, I'd say you're in a, in a new community that is always down for some games. We have a, we have an enthusiast triad that will talk theory for hours and then never uh, join a tournament. But if you ask them for, for like private games, they will uh, bounce on and they will, yeah, they, they will put you in your place. <laughs> Fuck yeah, shit! I need all the experience, all the knowledge. This this I'm, guy in our this guy in our chat, Theory Tittles, his name's Billy. He actually took out uh, Sonic Fox uh, last year. Some are you be Sonic Fox? Round one. But anyway. Fight. Okay. Mm. Uh, Storm Queen with the first damage. Subway Wang's trying to come in. Oh. Gets a sweep, takes off the feet. Mm. Okay, oh. Good pick up from the subway. Going to the wall. Oh, nice sidestep there by Queen. Oh, yeah, it's a big old whiff punish. Off the ground. Got her in rage. Let's see if he can finish her off before she gets a chance to use it. And yep, that is round one. Round two. <laughs> All right, Queen pretty much determined not to move at this point. I think she's trying to get a reaction going. Okay, we got sweeps. Oh, Subway comes in with a big grab. Tosses her back the other direction. Oh, okay, Queen with a nice loft misses the uh, misses the juggle, but still has the life lead currently. I had a clean chop to the midsection, put Subway down. Fight. Route a piece so far. There we go. I knew we had it in Oh. There we go. Solid punish from That's Subway. Looks like we're trying to go to the wall, sure enough. Mm. <laughs> oh. Yo, these wall hits. Oh, kind of went over, but that is it. Subway currently sitting on game point. All right. Queen comes in with the big throw to start things off. Oh, nice illusion. Got back in the way. All right, somebody's coming in. Good OPG pick up to the wall. Oh, almost to the wall, almost to the wall. Pushing to the ground. Oh, wall bounce. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, and a quick gut check. Gives game one to Subway Wang.
there. All right, Queen, how'd that feel? I'm analyzing everything right now, like okay. everything it felt to do when he would hit me, where he felt comfortable to hit, what he knew was coming, what strings he was used to. And I also definitely saw that this dude was literally testing me to see if I could put damage out. Oh. Then when he saw I didn't combo, but then when he saw that I could like keep him in a vortex, he was like, fuck that. We're finna fight now. And I was like, okay, cool. I respect that. Now let me see what you do. Show me what to avoid. Show me show me how it feels to be hit by you. I feel it. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. I still feel him holding back. Because when I hit him at he certain is. times, it was because I, I hit him trying to hit me. Because he felt me move, but, but, but he didn't know why I moved. Yeah. And I so, feel like he's so, watching. Subway, Subway, Subway is... is yeah, he's he's playing a teaching game, I think. I hate when guys do that to me. It made me want to whoop your ass. <laughs> to be fair, he's very good. He he wants you to feel that you're doing well. I think. No, that don't make me feel like I'm doing well by being coddled. Hey, you still you still whoop got that round ass. off. Well, that that round like off was legit. Oh, I know. <laughs> I told you, I, I told you, I felt him wake up and whoop my ass. I was definitely there for that ass whooping. I should mention yeah, we okay. actually we have a local a local guy. Uh, his name is Mr. J. Um, he is a Hi, Mr. J. He is a he is a high level Master Raven player, and I'm sure if oh, he uh, really? catches wind of your presence uh, out here, he would be more than happy to give you tips and suggestions going forward. So let's get into the match. Okay, so. Queen out with a pretty good lead. These nice little nickel and dime pokes and takes that first round. Solid roundhouse kick to the face. That'll do it. Oh, all right. Subway interrupts the uh, that elbow. Oh, sure you can. Okay. Oh, once again. Subway getting in there, disrupting Queen's setup. Oh. Oh, and there's those seven golden letters. She's not wrong about Subway waking up. He's gonna, he's gonna start slowly up in his game. Oh, nice use of armor on Queen's side. Up, oh, gets hit by the spring kick, right at the C bus. Nice grab. Oh, that was a nice duck too. Oh, okay, overhead into slide. Very nice stuff. Oh, Subway's got that rage going. Magic pixel power. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, that pickup to the wall. And there it is. Oh my goodness. Subway just taking it all the way back from Magic Pixel Town. Oh, nice armor on the trade. Queen's gonna be the first one there. All right, takes Subway off his feet. Good grab. Oh, set up the, uh, set up that big move. Anticipating the run in. All right, Subway. Things are still essentially tied though. Will you be merciless? Will you, will you, end, will you, will you end her whole career? Oh, nice illusion and Queen gets in the quick kidney punch. Okay, okay. Okay. All right, so. Subway. Minor life deficit versus Queen here. Oh, takes her off her feet. Good OTG up against the wall. Oh, and he puts the finishing touch on it. Good game, Subway. Good game. I definitely enjoyed myself. Like, yeah. Totally did. That was, that was fine. <laughs> All right. 
Well, there you go. There you go, Storm Queen. Got the got that under your belt. Feeling okay? With nah, yourself? I didn't. I want to fight more. Hell no, yeah. I want more. That's fine. Guess what? You, you'll have another shot in the in the lower bracket. Oh yes, double M. It double is double M. M. Yeah. We do things right around here. In fact, uh, yeah, you yeah. might get to uh, go in real quick. Uh, don't don't leave just yet because I don't. I'm not even sure if your I opponent actually exists it. or not. Uh, I mean, as long as I can fight somebody, I don't care if ain't nobody yeah. else said no offense. I do apologize. I said like that, but <laughs> I just want to fight. But yeah, so we're going I'm here for you. all the way down here to the bottom. Sorry, one of my a lot two of our guys actually play like they're not online most of the time. <laughs> so half my fucking friends miss my PlayStation. And, uh, oh, and I do apologize for always like swearing. I do apologize for that. It's just okay. All right, habitual. Uh, I'm not sure why medic. This. Okay, devout underscore medic. Okay, let's. Well, I can spell devout. I'm a I'm a college educated young man. There it is. Oh, I think he's actually like already. Made. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you're back. He's back and he's going to mm -hmm. play the casual and medic here in just a second. So medic actually plays a lot of fighting games. Uh, he's got his toes dipped into Street Fighter V. Uh, he's a high-level Grand Blue Fantasy Versus player. And uh, yeah, uh, I guess now he's doing Tekken. I believe he's tried his hand at Soul Calibur a couple times as well. I have all of those and more. Well, I play uh, those, are the, those are pretty much the ones we do throughout the week. I mean, I really despise the living life. I used to have dislike Street Fighter Five, but when they release all these other inferior fighting games in my eyes, like I really dislike Grand Blue Fantasy. Like I really, really dislike it. I love the anime, but I really dislike the fighting game. Um, the mechanics is like. I, I assume they should be the ways of familiar, like the spot that dodging. I'll be thinking that I'm playing, oh shit, pizza. <laughs> All right, there he is. Okay, so uh, we just got to get Medic and uh, Sloosh up to the top. So just mash your, mash your R1 until we get there. There we go. Yeah, I'm in the kitchen, but I got the controller, so I heard you. <laughs> All right, cool. I don't think we're gonna hear from 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 Munda, so uh, Storm, I'm just gonna advance you. Hey! Congratulations, you're already you're already one and one. <laughs> Rules. Just came here to watch you play on them three matches. Uh, but yeah. Once we get this going, uh, your next fight will be against Tiger Zord. Tigers are work. Yep. Oh, Tekken 7 might be his first serious fighter, says Medic in the chat. Okay. Mm. Is that a bubble G2? That was cute. You better have the bubbles looking right. Oh, I can't stare at bubble teeth for like at least a week at this point. Why have I heard this name several times in my life? This is a thing. What what name? Bubble tea. Oh, bubble tea? I mean, it's delicious in principle. I just saw something today that made me like, it's going to keep me away from it for a little while. Why? Wow, what happened? Oh, don't worry about it. It is not discussed in polite company. <laughs> send it to me. Send it to me. Send it to me. Yay. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, okay. We got Leo Eddie. and Eddie. Okay, so, Lafku could start. Medical could pick up. Taking the life lead over competitive. Casual. Oh, oh! 
Complete reversal of fortunes, nails him on the get up. Solid round one. Round two. Fight. This Eddie scares me. So yeah, uh, when you bring up Sloosh, the uh, the Midwest shudders. Because even the people who, who are pretty sure they can beat him don't want any of it. Let me see. Ooh, all right. Because his movement on those that's the one. Round three. Fight. All right. So yeah, Cash keeping on the pressure. Mm. Eddie trying to find his way in. It's always hard against Eddie's. Oh, there you go. Gotta watch them toes. Oh, nice pickup. Mm. Oh, wow. And competitive casual up right away. Not going to take any of these ground pounds. Mm. Oh. They're keeping appropriate distance. Oh, Medic's going to be the first one to the punch and takes the round. Okay, Medic. Round four. Fight. I think Medic has a type because in uh, Grand Blue Fantasy Versus, he, he basically plays like the, the black-haired version of this guy. <laughs> um, which character would that be? Uh, Lancelot. Um, the, the dual blade guy? Yep, that's the guy. I play him too. And then the ice lady. Oh, Catalina. Yeah, cause she's just my favorite. What's the introduced time to the anime? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, oh. they finally got somebody who's strong enough that can actually help them. Medic tying things up. Very cool, very cool. All right. Trying to go for the toes again. Casual doing the... Oh, my God, that ground bounce? Look at this pickup. We're going to the wall. Almost to the wall. Look at him knowing not to not to exploit his advantage. Mm. Oop, oop. Yo, Eddie used double slap. It's super effective. Mm. Oh. And after all that, competitive casual still walks away with those seven golden letters. Alright, here's the R1 stuff. Gotta get yeah, some gets ready out for the way. It. I was there watching it. Like, this could be my turn to press R1. Mm -hmm. well, let's see. Uh, loser of this will go on to play Cracker Jack. And, uh... And losers. And, yeah, we'll just pop in, get your match, uh, Fish Tiger Zord after this one storm, and... Oh, that's cool. I'm, I'm here for it. I'm watching. Cool, cool, cool. I'm definitely. And then we'll slide huh. back up to the winner's side. Uh, but while you guys are going, we'll have Cracker Jack and Loser of this one uh, do their match in another uh, in another room. So, Cracker Jack, if you're listening, buddy, just be ready to, to fight the loser of this one, okay? And then we should be all caught up. Okay, let's see if Medic can take this one. Ties it up, he gets one more shot at knocking a competitive casual into losers. It's not a thing that happens too often, but it has been known to happen. Okay, here we go. Oh, all right. Sloosh starting it off big. Oh. Oh, that trade. And they both fall to the ground. No advantage either way. We're back to neutral. Oh. Right. Catches casual on the windup. Nice OTG. Little foot stomping. Oh my goodness. All right, both in rage now. Oh, but Medic's going to pull ahead. Round one. Round two. Fight. Uh, 
right. Oh, we're going to the wall. Dang, medic. Out here doing God's plan. That's a dated reference. Nice loft. All right. Medic getting some nice hits in here. Uh oh. <sighs> Casual got the loft though. Just abusing that prone body. Good duck from Medic. Unfortunately, he just can't uh, get his offense going and get him. Casual puts himself on match point. Very nice. Oh, good. <clears throat> yeah, good lift. Uh oh, this might be it though. Oh, yep. That will do it. All right, competitive casual taking it over medic 2-0. Still, pretty good fight, I've got to say. Medic definitely putting in that work. It just did, uh, didn't come through for him this time. It's Too many things. To see, and this is the other thing. If you really don't want to play, you can't just put yourself in like a, a spectator position. You've got to constantly monitor the thing. Anyway, challenge is being weird. Okay. All right, competitive casual 2-0 over medic. Pretty good fight though. Uh, we are going to be going on to Tiger Zord versus Dark Storm Queen on the screen. This is a thing. Hey, Cat Daddy J. Sorry. You okay, so Dark Storm Queen, meet Mr. J here in the in the Twitch chat. Uh, he's going by Cat by by Mr. Uh, Cat Daddy J. Uh, Cat Daddy J. This uh, this guy is like the best Master Raven player in the Midwest. Oh, that's the guy you was talking that's about. That's the earlier. guy I was talking about. If uh, if he was Let playing tonight, you could see his stuff. You'd, you'd, you'd be inspired eight ways to Sunday. I like being inspired eight ways to Sunday. That's my shit. Okay, sorry, it's just too much to. All right. No, I need to invite players. Okay, so uh, yeah, Tiger Zord, I'm getting you in here, buddy. All right, because I feel like we've been a small place. Maybe. Watch the movie. Guess after search for you. Yeah. Watch the movie. Am I cooking tomorrow? It's tomorrow. Wednesday. Oh, taco night! Ninety-two. That's the mm, that's the one. Like <sighs> I'm trying to find the link to your stream, so. Oh, I it's can uh, get just mat finger. matchstick melee. All the all the, right all the right words. the right words. <laughs> It's just exactly how it sounds. Did you play Smash Brothers Melee by any chance? Uh, I did back in the day, but in the, for this particular channel, I just chose Melee to mean fighting in general. I'm gonna sort of follow your thing real quick. Let me just add it over. Yeah, that's Tiger Sword and Dark Storm Queen. Tiger Zord 92. Okay, no, no, no. Oh, is it Tiger Zord underscore 92? Did I mess that up? Oh my god. I hate this. <laughs> I hate this so much. 
Why? The, uh, no, it just, this is so, it's so much more awkward than it has to be. Like, if you want to see, like, probably one of the best lobby systems around, uh, Grand Blue Fantasy Versus, like, hands down, has it. It's not perfect, but mm. it has enough advantages over everybody else. That, uh, I would take it any day of the week. There we go. All right. Tiger's Zord. Bam. All right. That's the real one. Pick up trunks. There we go. Got it. Got it. Got it. Hey. All right. There you go. Uh, there you go, Storm. That's your guy. Hi, Tiger Zord. I'm ready to fight you. Yeah, that's the kind of stuff we like to hear. These high level ass people. I'm gonna add them. <laughs> Can I add you guys? You're gonna learn a lot. Uh, and I'm sure they'll be more than happy to, to add you uh, when we're all done. Mm. Okay, so yeah. Uh, Tractor Jack and Medic should also be playing, so they'll knock that out and get back to me with results. And then we'll move into winners. Slide three. Okay. I'm on my phone. Okay. Yeah, Mr. J, new blood. Uh, this is this is Dark Storm Queen with me on the mic. Mm -hmm. I mean, she she's she's been playing Tekken for uh, since two, but. Uh, She's new to new to our stream. Don't don't lie to him. I just just tell him I've been mashing buttons all my life. It kind of looked like I know what I'm doing. But I don't no, know no, what no. I'm, I'm doing. I'm, I'm overselling you. I'm I'm 100. Nah, 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 nah. Don't do that. Cause then they gonna ask for their money back. You know, you gotta sell your product <laughs> accurately. Uh, I, it's quarantine. I'm not trying to take anybody's money right now. <laughs> that being said, if you guys are enjoying what you're watching on uh, Matchstick Melee, you know. The subscription button's right there. <laughs> the and that's all that's all I'll button. say about that. All right. So Dark Storm Queen versus Tiger Zord. Let's see this. I can't say I'm, I'm too familiar I was with pick Asuka. Yeah, Asuka, baby. Watch out for that uh watch out for that back three. And there go my my Asuka player right there just logged in. I wonder if she's gonna watch the broadcast. Hey, I have to switch it up. I should have kept Master Raven if I was gonna fight Asuka. Cause I had to stay too close for Nina. Why y'all poking my toes? My toes! Round one. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, good Lord. I'll hit the buttons one of these days. Okay, so. Oh, all right, we got the ground bounce. Tiger Zord's taken to the wall. Not quite though. Queen's up on her feet. Little, little, you know, peck and poke. Oh, okay. Went for the big fake. No TG to finish off. Oh. Dark Storm Queen sticks out of feeler, only have Tiger Zord rejected out of hand. Okay. Nice low sweep, but Queen was all over it. Oh, there it is. Back three, baby. <laughs> the party starter. All right. Pretty damaging. There's a string right there. Tigers are trying to balance. Uh... Oh, nice low parry. Oh, he's, he knew. Perfect. He can see the future, and there's a perfect. Round three. Fight. Oh, nice counter hit. Oh, okay, we got it. Ah, Tigers are breaking these grabs. Punishing that which must be punished. There's a sweep. Good block there from Queen. No can can for uh for Tiger Zord. Oh, nice use of the armor and darks from the Queen goes flying. Oh, nice grab. That was well timed. Woo! All right, rage on both sides. Nope. Oh. 
All right. And another grab. Oh, did the full flip. Round four. Fight. Okay, so Storm Queen trying to stem the tide right now. Oh, getting lost. The spring kick whiffs. Tiger Zord taking that one. That match felt way more aggressive. Yeah. The uh, first match not, and not the last match. Is, not everyone is Subway Wang. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm talking about, you know, fighting him throughout the matches of the whole, um, the whole set so far. Oh, yeah. Like the very first match. He felt like super aggressive with letting me know that he will consecutively move to get out of my like way. But then he also showed me that he has tons of fucking Nina knowledge. Mm -hmm. Tons of that shit. I felt that way. I'm like, you know, let I me mean, let me throw out these three these three fours real quick to see if he oh he he knows each each okay, yeah, I just got just got bounced. So I'm just gonna put back out this master raven. I actually was gonna play Asuka, but when I saw that he played Asuka and fighting him, knowing that he once he was once, once I can see that a person knows what's coming, he just waits to see what string I'm going to use. Mm -hmm. I have to go with my most unpredictable character yeah, because what I, I play, like I said, I'm, I'm hella unpredictable because I have no real like training like behind it, so. Hey, yeah, st st I'll stick see. stick with this uh, with this Discord kid. They'll they'll get you up to speed in no time. All I need to do is play this shit every day with a high people. Who whoop my ass every day? Whoop my ass every day for like at least thirty consecutive days. I promise you, my 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 level will be like not the same. Nowhere uh, near no, like the same. The close losses are the are the best way to learn. All right. Well, good luck in your fight. I'm gonna I'm gonna meet you on Discord real quick for the duration. Okie dokie. But yep, do your best. Commencing mission. Round one. Yeah, that's right, Mr. J. It's a it's a raven. This is why I was uh talking you up so much to her. This is this is her main. Oh, all right. Yo, we're putting these Converse to good work. These Chuck Taylors are going deep. Oh, that's the round, and that's a perfect Tiger Zord. Not messing around at all. All right, nice start. Got the backflip, sweep. Oh, we almost had a little barrage there, but Tiger Zord did some good guessing. Back three. Going to the wall. Sidewall save lives. Oh! Queen tries with the spring kick. Oh, and Tiger Zord knows exactly where to pop it. Oh! He did not know to move out of the way of that one. Oh, wow. Yeah, Tiger Zord seems to have this illusion uh, uh, pretty much figured out. That being said, Storm Queen is keeping pace. Might be able to take it here. Oh, missed the OTG bump. And reaches in. Round three. Fight. All right, round of peace here. Game two. Oh, nice. Queen catches Tiger Zord on the run and gets the grab. Oh, once again, hoping for the uh, hoping for the big one to come off. I know Jay, Jay pumped his fist at home when that first one landed. Yeah. Nice OTG, all right. Just do, just do the run by. Tiger Zord in rage. Let's see if he gets around to using the blue stuff. Oh, back three. This jungle might do it. Oh, plus frames. Ah, you're not getting up from that. 
Round four. Fight. All right. Tigers are making a, a declaration of war there. Nice, good grab. Tigers are not having a stellar record of breaking these things up oh, and giving it back. All right, we're out here testing our neutrals. Oh, okay. And another grab, and that's gonna tie it up one more time. It's still match point for Tiger Zord, but Dark Storm Queen is uh, proving that she can hang. All right, we got the distance. We got the distance, we got the movement. We got the shuck and jive. All right, oh. Queen puts Tiger Zord to the ground, but can't get the OTG. Oh. Oh. Threw that throw a little early. Nice faint. Oh, all right. Queen's off her feet. Tiger Zord tries to move in to get something going, but not quite. Once again, the illusion being dismantled. We've got Rage on Storm Queen. Knockdown, big damage. Keeps trying to get that throw. With the extra Rage, it probably could kill, but... Oh, nice. You don't see that one too often. And taps the ankles for the win. Okay. Darkstorm Queen getting on the board. 1-1 one, one currently. And I get out of the way. <laughs> yeah, that's right. How do you like that, Mr. J? How do you like that? <laughs> Is she doing good work by you? I hope so. Uh, let's see, while we're waiting right here, kind of casual and J Digga are up next. <laughs> He's digging it. Yo, Maximus, what up, buddy? How you doing? I haven't seen you in a while. Get ready for the next battle. 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 Oh, Dr. Science coming through with a Twitch Prime subscription as well. Thank you, buddy. We got the K-pop love icon. To be fair, I don't love K-pop, but I do love free icons. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Dr. Science, uh, squeeze us in. The uh, the operator, tournament organizer of our Tatsunoko versus Corona uh, tournaments that we've been holding minimum once a month, uh, pretty much since like March, April. Uh, always towards the end of the month. It's a really great time. There's also UMVC3 and MVCI. Uh, but he's the head honcho. Uh, follow us and you will get the lowdown on all of that. Or follow him on Twitter. But anyway, we're here for a final showdown in the marketplace. Storm is having, like, really amazing, uh, uh, like, good fortune with that long elbow of hers. Oh, and kicks the legs out from under Tiger's Ward for her first perfect of the night. All right, Tiger Zord taking a step back, kind of getting, getting, getting their bearings. All right. Oh, take it off the feet. He's gonna have to get in there. Oh, there we go. Solid punish. Queen with the juggles avoids the back three and gets on top for the full. No, sorry, three out of four punches. Oh, again. Ooh, Queen a little greedy there with the big unblockable. Oh, all right, Tigers were coming in. Gets the grab, no break today. Oh, Queen's still in there by a little bit. But we've only got seven seconds left. Tigers or doesn't need him. Puts himself back on, we a tie game. Oh, 
on the dirt. No OTG from Queen. Oh, once again, that long elbow into the grab. Oh. Tiger Zord checking those ankles. Might have found a way in. Who knows? Oh, the Can Can gets uh, Tiger Zord out of that grab. Ooh, nice. Good teleport away. Another big throw. And Tiger Zord in rage. Let's see if it comes out. Oh, sweeps Dark Storm right out of that. Oh, and whiffs. That was a fantastic sidestep. Queen still with the life lead. Oh, maybe not after this. Oh, Tiger Sword couldn't do it. Oh, couldn't do it the real way. And Queen just couldn't make up the life difference by the time the clock ran out. That's rough. It's again, the long elbow. Tiger Sword starting to nail these nickel and dimes. all starting to add up. All right. Queen's starting to get her get her, get her, her feet underneath her. Oh, nice. Transitions into the slide after the long elbow. Good break from Tiger Zord. And they are dancing around. Time halfway over. Oh. Gets the grab again. Ooh. Nice jump away. That was actually really well timed. Oh, came in hot. High and overhead, and ties it up again. Oh my goodness. Double Luigi situation. One of these two is going home after this round. Or, you know, staying home with a bucket of popcorn or what have you, but still. Nice slide in again. Tries to catch the big meaty kick on Wake Up. Oh, the trade. And Queen with the grab. Oh! Tiger Zord taking Queen out of the air with that back three again. Uh oh, got rage on Queen. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh no! You win. It was so close, but Tiger Zord managed to get that throw off and take the game. Holy cow! Alright, well, while I calm down from that, let's get our next competitors in here. And I'm sure, uh, I'm sure Queen will, will join us back on the mic when, uh, when the, when the feelings have subsided. Still not a bad match. Oh, there she is, everybody. Dark, Dark Storm Queen in the Twitch chat. You don't have to go, you know. You can stay and commentate the rest of the fight if you want. Or the rest of the tournament, I mean. Yo, Fight Sessions is here too. What? All right, so competitors, if you're listening to the chat, um, as we start depositing people into the losers round three, um, loser of this one will be facing uh, Tigerzord92, and loser of Nate versus Subway Wang will be facing Medic. So uh, once those fights are established, go ahead and knock them out, because uh, we're just going to keep trying to plow forward, okay? Yeah, Darkstorm Queen, you are always welcome back. Our next uh, Tekken 7 tournament's actually going to be uh, two weeks from now, and it'll be on PC. But uh, next week, I believe, we're doing PlayStation 4 Soul Calibur, which is always fun. On paper.
All right, all caught up. Looking forward to this one. Because we got a pretty brutal Gigas here. Round one. Fight. Ah, oh, Cat Daddy J's trying to make it for the PC tournament. Yeah, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to talk about what's in your array later. Oh. Sorry, swapping sides. All right, so we got a nice big wall splat there. Jay Digga trying some uh, intimidation tactics. Got his rage up. Oh, that could be bad. Oh, here comes the blue stuff. Oh! Oh! Yo, that was pretty brutal. Let, let's get that. Let's get that clip. Oh, that's a good start to the round. Casual picking J Dig off off his poop. And he comes in hot overhead. All right, J Dig has got that rage again. Casual looked like he was giving uh, J Dig a room to breathe, but it was all a facade, a ruse, if you will. Question in the chat: When's Akuma? When you start learning him, Sky. Oh, hey, it's Mr. J. Oh, hey, it's Mr. J. Oh, hey, it's Mr. J. Oh, jeez. There's an echo. All right, we'll try that again in a second. Okay. Uh, and competitive sloosh. Nailing round three. Big start there for Jay Digga. Oh! Takes casual off his feet. To the wall. Yep. Oh, wow. Nice evasive get up there by casual. Oh, it's Jay Digga whose back is against the wall. And eating sweeps. Alright. Oh, nice low parry. Is the rage going to come into play? Oh! Ooh, there was some tension on that one. Okay. Well, competitive casual is going to go ahead and take game one, although that was pretty dang close, I would say. I am not your guy. All right. Okay. And uh, so, yeah, we'll have after this, RT Nate and Subway Wang. That'll clear out our uh, winter semis. Okay, let's try this again. Hey, that sounds way better. Get ready for I wasn't I wasn't echoing to all heckin' back. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what was going on with that, but yeah, I I just got a new computer today because my five year old build completely died on me, so I've got to oh, pretty much start from scratch. And that's a shame. I'm I'm kind of an old man now, and I really didn't care for the whole hey, let me just rebuild this whole computer. I was like, no, nah, I'm not doing that. What's in it? What's in it? What's in it? What's in it? What's in it, you say? <laughs> All right. Well, He's first like, off, it's me. Like, I'm just I kidding. Wasn't expecting uh, a quiz. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. You're going to give me talk about my tech. So I I went and got a uh, Alienware because I just didn't feel like building a whole entire system. I was like, no, I'm not. I'm not dealing with this shit. So what we've got is an Intel i7 10 700KF which okay. is one of the, the newer generation processors, sure, but sure. operating under, you know, some of the older, uh, the uh, I think it's like 14 mm NM or something like that. It's got 32 yeah. gigabytes of RAM, uh, DDR4 or DDR5. Sure. Sure. No, four, um, now the piece de resistance, what we're looking at here as we're dealing with this uh, Gigas 
and uh, Lucky Chloe match is a... Oh, where is it? I gotta look for this stuff. You can tell I'm old now. It is a uh, RTX 2080 Super. Dang! Okay. Not bad. J-Dig, taking that first round. Yeah. yeah. I just gotta get it to optimize with Tekken 7. It's a little rough right now, but uh, it is what it is. So anyway, on to this match. Yeah. Tell you what, I'll throw my my screen into Discord so you can watch along. Be a little more. That would be though. good. Let's see. Let me let me tune into you. Yeah. Tuning into you. I would never curse anyone. <laughs> but you never. By the way, we're round a piece now. J Dig is Gigas really holding his ground against uh, Slusha Libre and uh, Lucky Chloe. <laughs> It's supposed to throw all the damage in the back, not the back. Yep. It's the Hulk in the ass, like, no, nope, not today. Okay, 15 seconds in, we've got a combo. He's not going to get him to the wall. Cash is out on some damage. Good oh. chunk. What's that about not going it's to the wall? The second hit. <laughs> no, I, he got him there anyway. I'm a little shocked. I didn't think he would uh, get hit by that second hit. Keeping him very close to that wall. Yeah, he is. Well, anything that works out in his advantage, Chloe's going splat, and he's going to get, like, three or four free hits. Yeah, they're just about even on life, but we've got the red dress. He throws it, it's gonna hit. Wow! Yo, I didn't know the Left 4 Dead 2 tank was in this game. Hey, that tank <laughs> said, get your back turn shit out of here. <laughs> Sloosh, trying to make a comeback here. He's already up one game, but he got the launcher. Doesn't get him to the wall. I don't think he was really sure about the distance. Content to just poke him and uh, back off. Yep. Let him throw everything out. Says, you know what? I don't care. I've got time, and you need to take my life away. Ooh. Guess what? Right. Down kick. Very nice. Solutions. Getting J Digger off his feet. Nice flow combo. Yeah. Oh. Hey, armors. He went for the the classic. Didn't work. Oh, gets oh. caught. Up. Guess it out. Two rounds apiece. Yep. J Digger's got to make something happen though. here. Oh yes. Either Jay Digga is going to come back or he's going home. Doesn't break the one plus two. Gets launched. Ops for a simple combo. It's going to take him to the wall. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. What happened? Harada, I what don't are you doing? Know. Oh my God. Oh, Tekken. You're killing Why me. Why do you do this? Killing me. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Good God. Oh, man. And of course, they're probably done. Oh, yeah. Look at feel bad. More feels bad man frogs in the in the chat, please. <laughs> I guess I'll. Re no, just whatever. Yes. What? Oh, geez. The whole thing shut down. Oh my what god. What happened to your PS4? Did it just have a heart attack? Dude, I just well, see, I just downloaded the, the system update 8.0 this afternoon. I don't know. Ah, uh, uh, okay. It's not like it shut down or anything, which is a, a problem that I thought it has been having while it was in rest mode, but like Yeah, what the heck? That that made me really sad. Oh not dude. Alright. Oh wait, before okay. Sloosh says he finished before that happened. Uh what what did happen? Who oh, took the, that? Then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's the big mystery. And let's get a did double win, confirm. Sloosh. If JD is in here, get him to confirm that too. I, I I'm not saying I don't doubt what Slush is saying, but uh, you just you always want to go through the habit of that just to make sure. Yeah. No shenanigans. <laughs> Otherwise, someone's getting pistol whipped. I love that people are using the uh, I know that uh, I know that Sweet. reference emote. That's good. Isn't it good? All yeah, right, so Sloosh did in fact win. Okay. Yep. Okay. I'm good with that. Well, I guess that's a quick and easy way to finish things out. Oh, Chalange, why they they I hate Chalange right now. They installed some sort of new like DDoS protection thing, and it just makes it so you can't update anything if the screen's been unrefreshed for like 30 seconds. All right, so that that begs a million dollar question. Why aren't you using Smash GG? It, dude, Smash GG is so like overly complicated to set up a simple tournament. Like they want you to create an event, and then you have to put like a game in your event. And it's it, like there's a million different things that can go wrong with it. Honestly, challenge is like, here's where we are. Here's when we're doing it. Here's the game. Let's go. <laughs>
Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. I, I'm not going to disagree with that. I always just kind of, you know, I always ask that question when it yeah. comes to uh, people's preferences between Smash. Like if and I was Jalan. if I was running a multi-stage or like a multi-event thing, uh, then for sure, yeah, probably Smash GG because that's what we use for the uh, the versus Corona. Um, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, just for one event a night, ch challenge is usually fun. Anywho. Uh, okay. Okay. I'm gonna direct uh, Jay Digga and Tiger Zord to go ahead and fight uh, while we go and take care of Nate and Subway Way. Oh, by the way, shout out to uh, Dark Storm Queen for uh, the Raven play. That was really exciting to watch. It's never a dull moment when you watch a Raven player. Okay, uh, but yeah. RC Nate. And Subway, since you see bus, whatever you want to call it. Hey, why don't we just uh, set up a first to 10 or a first to 20 between Subway and Fuyu, since Ooh. you keep playing and nobody plays with him, but he never gets on to play it. He's too busy spending his time talking about how Lucky Chloe and Maria Rose are thick when they're really not. They're not. Well done, stakes. Are you kidding me, you sinner? They're not. They're they're not thick at all. All right, let's try this again. And it's mainly. Okay. Good session. October seventeenth at eleven twenty-seven a.m. <laughs> That's huh? so specific. Wait, what? Okay, artsy Nate. Uh, where'd you go, Subway? There he is. I don't know, who you Subway might uh, hit you at the, you know, the babality or something, and then what are you <laughs> gonna do? You're gonna have to change your diaper, bro. I don't even think who you plays Tekken anymore. Who you probably spend all his time playing Genshin Impact. Oh yeah, for sure. He's probably he's probably playing it on mobile too. <laughs> you not have enough hard drive space in your PS4 for you? <laughs> Maximus is like that's the move though. <laughs> you know what? I'm not gonna lie. If if you ever get into some type of a aggressive verbal exchange with somebody, tell them to change your diaper. That'll just throw them for a total loop. Mm. I'll say all sorts of you know crap like f you and f this be like yeah we'll change my diaper bitch <laughs> be like excuse me what does that even mean hey have you changed a diaper before it's, it's a nightmare because you have to touch touch poop and poop is gross to quote but troy barnes from community as an actual dad i can attest to having to change diapers it's uh mm. No bueno, but you do what you gotta do. Exactly. Do Shout out to the dad out there. Yes. Do what you can for your crotch goblins. Let's go. <laughs> I see you in the chat live. What's good, bro? There he is. Okay. Night Blythe in the chat, also known as the uh, the Yoshi from Cincy. The Yoshi. Oh, the Yoshimitsu. Okay. The Yoshimitsu. I can appreciate that. Personally, I find Yoshimitsu in Tekken much less annoying than Yoshimitsu in Soul Calibur. I think a lot of people would actually say that uh, Yoshimitsu in Soul Calibur is better than Tekken Yoshimitsu. Oh yeah, I, I, totally. That's why I don't find him as annoying in, uh, <laughs> in Tekken. His voice in Soul Calibur is hilarious. Oh, it is. He's, he's like full on like Kabuki actor. Yeah. Uh, so, Tangentially, uh, long Soul Calibur. Um, I recently came into a copy of Soul Calibur 2 for the GameCube um, on my computer, and uh, going back through and getting all that stuff uh, like unlocked again has been a treasure. I forgot how fun that game is to play. Isn't it, I mean, you can play it now and still have an incredible time with. And that game is at least 15 years old. Yeah. At least. I mean, I was playing that shit in high school. Sometimes when you do things right the first time. Yeah. 
God, I miss that. I really do. Why did well, you have to do that? Now you're making me miss my, my teenage years. And... Dude, now that you have a computer, we can get you your own copy of Soul Calibur 2 for GameCube on the PC. Oh, yeah. So I can run back with playing Talum again, which was Hell broken yeah. back in Soul Calibur 2. And I can play Link and bounce off of people's heads. Oh, don't forget, you can play Necrid. At Oh, 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 good. Yes, I had <laughs> forgotten. I was... I was a garbage character I've, piece of my soul you've unearthed from the from the, the before time from the long long ago <laughs> <laughs> all right so we got artsy nate and subway wang round one fight okay so we're dealing with leo and paul mm -hmm. artsy nate uh I've, I've seen him a couple of times yeah. okay uh, they get checked there subway Equal wang damage. took down uh dark storm queen earlier Center to the shadow realm. Yep, then she almost took down Tiger Zord. I was surprised. Oh yeah, no, she was she was keeping pace with him pretty well. Oh, look at that pop up. Oh, got launched. Mm. Just barely get him to the wall there. Okay, finishes out that first round. Clean. Archie Nate up 1-0. Yeah, Nate's no slouch. Didn't duck the second hit there. Big whiff. That could have been a death fist. <laughs> okay, just kind of uh Getting hit with strings there. Oh, he could have launched the crap out of that death fist. Oh, big whiff, but no punish Ooh. coming off of that. Seeing a little uh, tenacity here by Subway so far. He's got launched again. Yep. Oh. Oh, there we go. Took advantage. Got a wall, wall hit, but nothing there. coming out of it. Wow, big sidestep there. Ooh. Oh, Demo Man, he gets the punish. I like it. Red stuff. Yep. Wow, he didn't get up. That's nope. guaranteed. Yeah, Wang, and Wang basically death fisted him back. That was hilarious. You got a death fist? Guess what? Get this German fist. Yeah, take the take this skinny death fist. Skinny death fist? It's made with death soy. Fist, right? <laughs> <laughs> Call that dairy free death fist? Yeah, dairy free death fist. DDF. Or no, DFD. Wait for that string again. Yep. Second hit's high on that. We are at respect neutral oh. right now. Oh. Very, yeah, very respectful game so far. Oh, both very nice! Wang with the pop-up getting out of the grab. All the way to the wall and puts the kibosh on it. Kibosh with the combo video. Let's go. Put the soy sauce on it, Subway. <laughs> Jab. Oh. We'll do a second hit. Okay. Block that. Okay, didn't punish him for doing that, that attack. Ducks, wow! Yeah, Paul Paul covers a lot of uh, horizontal space with that down. Saw a lot of buttons exchange in that first 15 seconds. Ooh. Nice, takes him off his feet. Man, did you see that little sidestep? He did not take advantage of that. Oh! Just checked in there. And Art, yeah, wow. Nate not, not crowding the plate on uh, with Wang having a rage show. Oh, blue stuff. Burns the blue stuff, doesn't do anything for it. Oh, man, he threw that shoulder out there. Oh. That could have been death. He ties it up. Final so I'm, I'm really seeing some fight. adjustments here from the two of them where they're just, they're really not sure what's going to hit or stick. It's still kind of a match where they're really feeling each other out. Mm -hmm. yeah, those were a couple of nice side steps in the foreground for uh, Subway. Yeah, Ooh. we're seeing a lot of beautiful movement here. Okay, checks him with the mid. Ooh. Oh, gets him on the tail end of that. Yeah. Didn't think that was going to hit. To the wall, picks it up. Mm. Oh, low parry. Low parry. Oh, he could have done more than that. Ooh. Burns the blue stuff quick. I don't know if I agree with that. Okay, just a just a sliver of health here. Blocked it. And there he is. No ultra instinct. God. Yeah. Subway using that Jeet Kundo to shut it down. Nope, Kundo. Nope. <laughs> Isn't it a uh, like a Chinese martial art she does? Like Pai Kwa Kwan or something like that? Yeah, dude, you would know better than I. I I I can't I can't even keep the characters' names right. Uh in the first place. I, I definitely don't know the lore. Aside from like, don't know hey, Hachi's, hey, Hachi's a jerk. Kazu's a jerk. And they keep, both keep trying to like kill Jin or take his devil gene. Oh, the storyline of, of Tekken is just atrocious. <laughs> Especially when you add uh, Kazumi into it. Oh, yeah. Baji Kwan, okay. It's a similar style to uh, Julia Chang, if I'm not mistaken. Julia Chang. <laughs> Julia Chang. That's the, that's the only the way I can hear that. The Tekken. Get ready for the next battle. Are you ready? 
Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. Sometime next year, 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 year. We're not ready for the next battle. Oh, artsy Nate with the with the Eddie. Okay, now now this is an adjustment either we're seeing that maybe he feels more comfortable with this. Uh maybe there there's uh you know certain types of movement that maybe would work better in his responses to Leo's moves. Let let's see if this pick is gonna work in Artsy's favor. Heihachi Low is a child abuser. I mean, he oh, literally yeah. was like, you got the devil gene, I'm going to beat the shit out of you. Yeah. He's not a nice guy. <laughs> like, brr, I want to turn into the devil. Better abuse my children. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to figure out a way to get what you got, kid. <laughs> I'll either steal it or earn it. <laughs> if I can't get it, I'm throwing you off this mountain. And guess what? I didn't get it. Goes for the low poke immediately. Okay. We're in uh, one of my top five favorite stages. Just happy to stay in the middle of the stage. Mm -hmm. I mean, anything to keep yourself away from the wall, right? Right. Going into relax there. Okay, had a good back dash. Maybe this is the adjustment he needed. Okay, he's already got subway to half-life for about 35, 25 seconds in. Ooh, almost got the pick up there. Wow, he parried that. Whoa, <laughs> side switch. Oh, all right. Wang with the interrupt. Gets him with the back spring. Goes for Oki with the slippery kicks. Interesting. Okay, checks him with that, the safe strings. With the boot. Said, eat this heel. <laughs> Get down there and lick it. I didn't use my uh, baby feet on my feet, so <laughs> they're, they're callous as shit. Deal with this, German. Ooh, low kick. I object to a park bench being a wall. It's clearly not. It's like the antithesis <laughs> of a wall. Uh, the last I've checked, I've never been thrown into a wall that was just a park bench and had something good happen. True. But there's, no, okay, there's so... nowhere to splat against the bench. Like, all, you know, suddenly you're just sitting. <laughs> right. It's not like, oh, surprise, I'm standing up against this thing. There's a an invisible barrier. Two rounds up for Artsy. You've seen a, a, a very drastic change from the first match. He went for a back sway there. Nothing came from it. Mm -hmm. Oh, see. that could have been a launch. Oh. Nice clash. That was a good trade for Subway because that uh, that would have put him real close to death. Yeah, I mean, Subway ought to have pretty good Eddie knowledge. He had to fight Sloosh earlier. Yes, he has encountered that a lot, but uh, gets launched anyway. Doesn't get anything off the wall, but this is looking bleak. Subway's got to make something happen. Hmm. And we're tied. Yep. A solid 3-0 there. So we, we definitely saw a, a difference from Art sees Paul to Eddie. So he's going to have to walk in and stick with Eddie with uh, closing out this next this next set. Subway is going to have to take a moment. I breathe, <laughs> do some yoga, figure out what I need to do to uh, readjust wow. this. Ma Maximus is, is like heavily invested in uh, in Artsy Nate. Super hype in Artsy Nate. Artsy Nate, you got a fan. Take advantage of that, son. You can tell you can tell he's jazzed because his fingers are just doing all kinds of stuff that aren't that doesn't jazz. <laughs> <laughs> jazz finger my way into your heart. Oh God! What a finger bang bang you into my life. Yeah, we should start a boy band. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I, I think we'll what? go over just about as well as like NSYNC or, uh, or anything. I bet would, they did a, a comeback. Backstreet Boys. Yeah. Backstreet Boys? I'd sign up for that. We could just say we're them. No one would know. No one's, no one's oh paid attention. God. No one's paid attention for the last 20 years. What is this betrayal here? Wow. He, he went away from his main squeeze Julia. and brought in the side chick? You don't do that. You've been committed for years. You put a <laughs> ring on it. Man, Subway. All right, dude, you better make this work, man. Yeah, he you better, better win. make this work. You can't, just I, you, jump, you can't jump ship and lose. We've got the Julia checklist now. There's always a Julia checklist. You mm -hmm. ready for this? Go. One. One. Bow and arrow. Bow and arrow. Two. Yes, of course. <laughs> Two mad axes. Oh, yeah. Yes. Those, those are immediate check. If you don't do those, I'm disappointed. Fuyu and then says, three, we saw my fan art. Sorry, that's great. 
Go ahead, go ahead. Number go ahead. three is power Party Crasher. Mm. If you don't do a Party Crasher, I am disappointed in you. Most, well, yeah, but we need the multiple Party Crashers, right? We need Can Can and the Party Crashers. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Subway just taking these big feet to the face. Mm. Subway with the Wendy's, Julia. Look, yeah. you're not getting a four for four today. You're getting spring kick. Oh, there, oh, there it is. There it is. That's one. Party Crasher. Party crasher. We got two. Party Crasher. Four four one. Axes. Four four one. We'll... Yes, do it. Oh. Pick him up. Oh, the blue stuff. Get that shit out of here. Fight. <laughs> Come on, Wendy Chan. Let's go. Oh, oh he shut tried down to Party on Crasher. Start. Got launched. There it is. Party Crasher. There it is. That's a juggle, though. You gotta lift him up. <laughs> oh, he picked him up. Oh, what is this shenanigan? Is, oh, he only got the first hit of the can can. Show us your inner Quan. Come on. Four, there you four, go. Four. Dude, Let's that's go. It. There, I've got a number four for you. Shoulder checks. Shoulder. Oh, yes, indeed. Do the big armor. Yes. Getting launched, though. Ooh. Channeling there the inner go. spirit okay. of uh, gameplay with this uh, Eddie pick. I like it. Goes to the forward kick. That's heavily negative. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised we don't have uh, its gameplay here tonight. Oh, nice little yeah, parry. I miss gameplay. We There's need the party crashers. Around. What is that whip blue stuff? I don't Subway, know. I'm disappointed. That's the Ball real blue stuff. Though? That's the real blue stuff. Oh, no, he's getting grabbed. I am so disappointed oh, in you, no. Subway. What is this nonsense? Round three. Did you eat a Frosty before you started this? <laughs> Dude, you, you eat vanilla Frosties, don't you? <laughs> wow. You only do that's, chocolate frosties. That's here. a hard accusation to lay on a man. <laughs> oh, he said no to your helicopter shenanigans. Ooh. Wall splat. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, I like that hey, delay. We got seven golden side. letters. Yo, we're getting back into this. Let's go, Subway. 40 win, Mighty Ruler. You smurfing bastard. Hey, it's gameplay actually in the chat now that we're Game talking about it. Gameplay's in here. Oh! He charging! Oh, he almost had that! He did. All right, he just got to keep Nate off of his back this round, and he's got a good shot at this. Oh! He's got to play like a madman. Not yeah, getting does. launched like that's going to do anything. Almost got uh, some additional walk on Oh, damage. Party Crasher, it's working! There it is! Wow! That was like six Party Crashers. That was, that was really well done. I usually give up after about three or four. Three or four? Yeah, Amateur. three or four party crashers. Oh. Jello cups all day. He went for two strings with that. He did, and he got away with it. Wow. It's not being greedy if you get away with it. Okay, so Artsy Nate showing that, hey, you're going to do this uh, random pick, and uh, it's not going to stick very well for you. No, it is not. All right. So let me uh, facilitate the, the bracket moving on. We will roll into winner's uh, final, which will be competitive casual versus Artsy Nate. Subway, I'm disappointed. Everybody knows that you were supposed to get the chicken teriyaki and stick <laughs> with Leo, not the damn Black Forest ham. Boo, you're gonna have to school this man on Julia. Everything I, I know about Julia, I learned from watching Fuyu. For which real. explains why I lose all the damn time. <laughs> No command grab two. <laughs> you didn't even complete the uh, the can cans for the combo damage. What what's the tenacity there? I bet he drains his rice with a colander. <laughs> 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 with a colander. Hi ya. Hi ya. Hi ya. Oh. You cannot make your rice wet like that. Your rice too wet. You fucked up. You will but fuck also, up. Also, your rice too dry. You also fuck up. <laughs> Hi, -ya. Hi -ya. <laughs> There we go. All right, I brought the chat awesome. back now that people aren't like putting disgusting words into it. Disgusting words like yes. hand holding. Bill Billy and the rest of his ilk. Holy oh, cow! No. Nightfly coming through the Nightfly is coming some. through. Thank you. Holy cow! Why this snutting on everybody? Oh, wow, man, Nightfly, thank you for the generous. Just, just getting the paper with this. Down. I love Holy that. Cow. Damn. Damn. See, and people talk about me being big time because of this tournament. Why is able to buy, you know, all these uh, tier one subs? I yeah. can't do that shit. Nightfly out here making it rain. Lord Blythe. <laughs> Lord Blythe. You know what? Why not Blythe Sama? 
Blythe Sama tonight. Lord Blythe with the the big ponytail. Or or uh, Bly Blythe OG. That way he's Prince Blythe. Blythe OG. O O O G. Yes. O O G. O O G. O O G. O O G. Sounds a lot like o orgy. Yeah. Let's be real. I don't. I don't think daddies. Blythe is really into the. Yeah, we got two daddies now. Y'all got two daddies. Me and Blythe are gay. <laughs> Not really. He's got a wife, and <laughs> I've got a fiance. Like, like, man, you are hiding it really well since you have like I'm, a child and all. <laughs> I know it's it's very it's a very binary thing. You know, I actually did accuse to be a gay gay, once for every, with, uh, gay for everyone but my wife of a million years. <laughs> 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 Women, I don't need those. Kids, ah, it's just a cover. That's a deep cover. <laughs> <laughs> We're deep in territory right now. I've got a, uh, I've got a, a thing that, that'll let you see the uh, thing a little bit more easily here. Ooh, and you're gonna give me the special I'm treatment? Give you the special treatment. Matchstick. I didn't think we were uh, connected like that. There. Now you got a full screen preview. How about that? Ooh. How about that jazz. Don't tempt me with a good time. Your screen's all blurry though. What is this low tech appeal? Oh, that's better. Good. Yeah, I'm, I'm blowing it up, up for you. Thank you. Oh, you're blowing it up all right. Stream is paused. Oh, I know why. Okay, there it is. I just got to move this to the other window. Hang on. Okay, so we got RC Nate and competitive casual. Sticking with the Paul this time. Round one. Okay. And casual rolling with Lily this time. Okay. Oh, short, short skirt girls. Let's go. <laughs> yep. Reverse them. Yep. Sloosh loves his uh his his raven hair girls. Yes, they all are raven haired. That's not a bad thing. If it's, if it's not Neely, then it's uh, uh oh, what's her face? The the creepy the creepy ground crawler. Zafina? That's the one. <laughs> I should just revise the character's name in, in my playlist. <laughs> Creepy ground crawler. Creepy ground crawler. <laughs> Egyptian spider chick. Let's go. Egyptian spider woman. Oh. Ooh, shredder kicks. He doesn't get it, though. Yeah. Okay, he doesn't Yo. break the one plus two. Dude, About even on life. That was like 40% health off one. Oh, grab. my God. No! RC Nate had that! Mr. J with the with the, the Joseph Joe Star. Oh my god! <laughs> That's my favorite character out of every single one. Cross chops. Oh. Get dunked on. Ten seconds in, mm -hmm. RC got the life lead again. But Sloosh is uh yep. high level capable of uh, really snatching around rounds like this. Hey, Sloosh is still oh, Sloosh. Oh, look at that. And just like I said, he snuck in that launcher there. Going to take him to the wall. Oh, oh. Oh, side switch. That's a done round. Mm. 30 seconds in, and he's up round. two rounds yeah. here. Fight. Our teammate, got to get on the board. Got to stop looking at the cabbages. Yep. Get into the fight. Yeah, Take don't, one don't of those get, carpets. Don't get attached to those cabbages. The avatar will be along any second. Right. My cabbages! Simple combo. Ooh. Low damage. Yo, Ooh, death Plus frames. Death is? Yo. And oh, the almost gods. got it. Oh! He finished that string. Sloosh thought he was only going to do one hit of that. Fight. Taking those rounds back. Yep. That's exactly what you got to do it. Sometimes when you, when Checking you, guess, the your, you guess your opponent's not going to be greedy, and then they, then they make you feel bad about your choice. Oh, it's great when you think, oh, I got this. And then it's suddenly, no, I don't got this. <laughs> Running three. With the reverse hit of Shredder oh, Kicks. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'll tell you what, Paul really does seem to cover a lot of uh, horizontal space, even when he's, like, attacking vertically. His tools are, are just incredible. And considering uh, as a legacy character, he has a lot of, of, of growth that's came along through the entire franchise of Tekken. I bet he has. Very quickly sealing that next round. So we're 2-2 two -two here. Winner's final, so this is a three out of five. Mm -hmm. A lot of time to make oh. adjustments. Nice reversal, and gets the full set of smacks. Wow, got the reversal on the ultimate tackle, smacked him around, and then hopped in his face. Damn. Can't get enough of that golden crisp. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, goes for that second hit. Sloosh punishing it. Good job. 
checking him on the frames. Mm -hmm. Got jabbed out oh, of a yeah. big hit there. Yeah, Nate, Nate's really uh, really showing showing off here with these crouch jabs. Got 25 seconds. Nate's got to make something happen. Mm. Didn't punish the hop kick, though. Damn. Oh, gets whiff <laughs> punished for that. All right. That is one for casual. Casual sealing that one up. It, it seems through the flow of the match that Artsy was really starting to make some adjustments and Sloosh just completely readjusted and said, nah, you're not you're not coming back from this. You're going to have to hold these cabbages. <laughs> and then maybe, just maybe, I'll let you have another round. But sit there holding the cabbages. I'll be back for you, all right? Hold the cabbages. Hold them. These cabbages are your L's. You're going to hold them. <laughs> you're going to have to deep fry them. Put a little oil, salt, and pepper on them. Mm. Have a good time. All right, Tekken, what are you thinking about? Man, you know, that that really reminds me of something. You know what Murphy's Law is, right? Uh, yeah, the uh, if anything can go wrong, it will. Yeah, have you ever heard of Cole's Law? Yes, it comes uh, it comes along with your six fingers in a in a in a combo at raising canes. It's thinly sliced cabbage. <laughs> Thanks, I'll be here all week. Immediately switching to Eddie. Okay, this will be interesting because we saw some success with Artsy using Eddie in his previous match, but uh, Competitive Casual also has Eddie as a uh, as a character oh, right in many are. in his toolbox that he uses. So let's see if he can bring this to effect against an experienced player like Competitive Casual. Fight. We're going to the jungle jam. Damn. Gets booted. Such so a, much damage. Yeah. Such a happy uh, soundtrack to this stage. You gotta love it. Nothing like hearing the happy tunes and thinking about violence. Exactly. How do they clear out all team? the all the all the seven to the three to seven year olds to, to get this going? <laughs> they just kick him in the face. Get out of here. Lily, Go back Lily home. He probably mom. bought them all like arcade tokens or something. He was like, "Get out of here." <laughs> she got Sebastian to uh, handle all the paperwork. Oh, of course. Got counter hit, but dropped the combo though. Mm -hmm. Didn't stop from putting on a little show. Just uh, kind of being content with uh, opening up the, the arena here. 15 seconds in, Ed Artsy's got to make something happen here. Yeah, he does. He's got to make a big move in a big way. So this is, oh, okay, gets the oh. tailspin from that. Barely missed to the wall there. Oh, Five seconds. Kick. Oh, Ooh, saw that low. any of that. Oh, wow, the tailspin, what was that? <laughs> it auto-corrected oh, for him, that was then crazy. He, yeah, then he just slipped sliding away. Just hopped on out of there. The bunny hop. <laughs> Nate scoring a few early hits. Takes the life lead. Not a bad way to go it with uh, this type of gameplay. Sloosh, known to be an excellent poker. Loves to do the uh, death by 10,000 cuts. Oh, nice. Wow, sidestep that. Oh, oh. Oh, just went for the mid there. Round three. No, I'm, I'm, I'm not too sure about the Eddie pick in this because uh, we've seen two rounds go by and uh, he almost made something happen, but uh, didn't, didn't really eke anything out. Yeah, I, I think he was having better luck with Paul, quite honestly. Yeah, seeing a very difference in how to apply different tools and you're seeing the experience of uh, Ooh. competitive casual with what he knows about Eddie, but he gets a throw anyway, generic throw. Low pokes. 30 seconds in, he's almost got a round. He goes for that second hit. Gets one on the board. Artsy desperately needing to, to get this round. Down jab and the hop kick. Breaks the one plus two, excellent. Oh, tried to down jab there. That's a dangerous proposition. It, it is. Slippery kicks, yo. Ooh, all right, Nate. Just narrowly missed getting hit by that that jolt that ugh, if I could speak English today. Nah, it's too hard, bro. Blocks the slidey. Very nice. Yep. Oh Puts yeah. It's Artsy in the red dress. Look at the windmill. We don't get it, but it's still pretty. Man, duck that throw. That was a yep. 
egregious. <laughs> it's checked on the ground. Nate's like, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? <laughs> and that, and you know what? Those type of situations are are, are where competitive casual really excels at. That yep. when they've got when he's got the life lead, just back off and let them just kind of ha hang themselves because some risk has to be taken at that point. Oh, Luge is better than comatose. Maximus don't uh, don't making, let comatose hear you say that. Maximus making some deep declarations in the chat over here. I'm sure comatose would have something to say about that. Well, he's too busy uh, having uh, hot takes on Batman versus whoever on on Facebook to, to actually fight. There, there is uh, yeah. There's always goofy takes. Like his last one was about chalk, like mint chocolate. Yeah, mint chalk. First of all. If you don't like mint chocolate, there's something wrong with you. <laughs> hey, first of all, thin mints in the freezer are amazing. Ooh, and then second so of all, right. Andy's chocolates, the little mm. rectangular chocolates, holy free holies. Like like those little the, the little Andy's mint uh like mint chocolate chips like in a brownie. Uh. Oh. Yes, we're getting dirty with food right now. <laughs> okay, switching to Paul. Yeah. All right. The first match that he had, he used Paul, and it, it definitely worked a lot better. It was a lot. It was a lot more aggressive. He got a lot. Got a lot more punishes for what he needed. So let's see if he can put some uh, put some slickness on it and do him with this area. Exactly. Miss Goosey, have a death fist. You like it a death fist? You like it a death fist? You like it a juice? Huh? Oh yeah, you like it a death. You like it a juice? I get you, Bunchy. Like <laughs> <laughs> no soup for you. No for you. Throwing out so many quotes that all these uh, Zoomers don't know. Oh, no, they're not going to. Like, who's Seinfeld? Why are they referencing him? <laughs> what are these antique millennials talking about? Yeah, pretty much. Fight. At least we're not as old as Ryan Vile. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> that was cruel, even by that standard. <laughs> Why'd you go there? Went for the second hit. Okay. Archie kind of oh, keeping oh, his back to the wall. Casual. He's doing his little bunny hops uh, while rotating around, too. Very nice. Getting the punish. We're almost uh, 30 seconds into this match. He's, you know, with the with the bunny hops, he does have a couple of options uh, coming in high or low off of those. Absolutely. Very content to just uh, play this poking game and... Uh, Artsy kind of falling into it. He's yeah. really at a life deficit now. Yeah, he got is. 20 seconds to make something happen. And unfortunately, he... that round was not it. Yeah, Nate tried to close the gap, burn off that rage in some way uh, uh, or another, and uh, Cash was just like, haha, all according Ooh. to plan. Threw out the death fist and got punished hard for it. Mm. You know, we've got it. We, You know what we have not seen yet? We have not seen a sidestep Matterhorn. Ooh. Like, at all. I wonder if it's coming. Oh, it checks him on the hop there. There we go. That's some big damage. Got the blue stuff. Had him to the wall and let him get away from it. Yeah, Nate not pressing his advantage. Interesting. It's not like you have to worry too much about wake-ups in this game. The media usually prevails. Wake-ups? What are those? <laughs> I don't do that. Ooh. Gets him with the generic throw. Just over the line. All right, this is... Match point for casual. Yep, set point here. Artsy on his on his set life. Got to make something happen. Yep. Checks him with the lows. Got to get around at least, Artsy. Oh, the snake dash. Yeah. Good lord. Where's that fire you had in the first game? Yes, I want to see that. Oh, he oh, threw out the shoulder. Generic the throw. Red dress Paul is dangerous. Paul, demo man, do it again. Mm -hmm. Wow. Do the low again. Do it. Ooh, oh, we got the plus stuff. frames. Wow, right just got checked. And that is it. Good adjustment on the combo there. So competitive mm -hmm. casual. He definitely... Taking three games with uh, with authority. <laughs> yeah, with authority. There's another reference that most of the Zoomers won't know. Nope. That's why we have the, uh, the Captain America. Uh, I got that reference emote. That's I got, yeah, right I get there. that reference. <laughs> <laughs> I so you, love it. So you can get the it. reference and then use that reference to get the reference. Hey, I could use that emote since, uh, you know, Big Daddy Blythe gave us all tier one uh, subs, correct? Ooh. Ellie's in the chat. What up, Ellie? What's good, Ellie? Yeah, look at that. I can use this. 
All right. Yeah. So Tiger Zordon Subway. We got Ryan H. in here, oh, too. I, gotta, I keep, keep forgetting I've actually I didn't get Tiger Zord as a friend because I signed him up. My friend requested the wrong Tiger Zord. What's going on, Ryan, you dapper motherfucker? <laughs> Tiger's Ord 92. And. Subway. Oh, he paid for bits to say that Sluge is better than Comatose. Wow. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Those are, those are channel points. Those are channel, channel points. Channel points? Yes. Oh, okay. I thought they were the bits. Oh, Subway says it's time to make everyone's characters look bad. All right. All right. Those are goals. Subway about to use Raven? Do it. <laughs> play Raven. For play Katarina. Raven. Yo, I know what you should play as. Play as Farang. Ooh. <laughs> no, wait. Play as, play as P-Jack. Oh, or no. Jack no, 7. That'd be that'd be He's Jack 7 in this one. Jack 7. Yeah, they didn't put the prototype Jack in. No Kazuya? Man, nobody likes Kazuya. Hey, blame your boy Maximus. He didn't show up for this tournament. We could have had the Kazuya play if he showed up in it. Oh, Subway's going to play Jack. That's right. He does play Jack. He actually does have experience and knows how to play Jack pretty well. Just reminding the, uh, the Discord that Loser Semi is a two out of three. Two out of three is about to be a bloodbath. Mm. Tiger's Orton Subway. <laughs> hey, it's a CBB. I Play don't know Potemkin, about you. Ellie, you get out of here. Well, when I think about fighting, you know, a Tiger's Zord, I mean, Power Rangers, I think about getting a Subway sandwich. <laughs> I mean, a foot long, that'll, especially uh, old Subway bread, it oh, feels yeah. like a baseball bat. Did, did you know that um, there was a, a the, the Ireland tax code uh, did not consider Subway bread to be bread. I read that. Yeah, yeah, so I read what they did scientifically with that, so I won't put too much engineering talk into it, but basically what they said was the sugar content, the percent sugar level in Subway's bread is so high that it's not considered bread by Irish health code standards. Right. Which turned out to be like... I mean, that's only the tax code saying that because the rest of like their their version of the FDA was totally was totally fine with it. Yeah, and they, and Subway, Subway actually issued a statement. Yeah, not Subway Wang. I mean, if Subway Wang is like, like the secret bread CEO, is not cake. Like after Jared, they found Subway and was like, "Hey, bro, do you want to advertise sandwiches?" <laughs> and not that other stuff. Not yeah, you can do the sandwiches, but leave all that other stuff at home. We don't we don't want to know about that. All right, Subway. Wow. So you gotta you gotta pull this Suzaku Jack Seven out and uh, make infamous Kev eat his words. Oh yeah. Oh is Kev? Oh Kev's talking the talking the good. Kev stuff. is talking that shit. Uh... How long before we see a debug? I'm just saying. First round, second round. What's your bet? Know. The match actually has to has to, has to start. So. <laughs> Hey, I'm allowed to be impatient about this, sir. I'm ready for this. We're in the duo with the serio. Fight. We're in the duo with the senor. With the record. Ooh, almost had the hammer there. By the way, I appreciate Tiger Zord actually dressing like the White Ranger for this. I love that. <laughs> He's gonna pull a flute, a sword flute out of nowhere. Mm -hmm. Start well, mad uh, styling by playing so, a tune. So, so, Saba, Saba didn't do any, didn't do any music. Oh no! Also, White Ranger wasn't really a part of uh, Power Rangers, but we can talk about that later. Man, you really about to throw some Power Rangers lore at me? I Listen am. here, Steve. Oh! oh! Got hit by the sidestep four. That's a rare move. Is Tiger Zord secretly Billy? <laughs> <laughs> we got to see an Oscar, yeah, an we're, Oscar we're, mirror match. We're not, we're, not, we're, we're not seeing back three every like thirty seconds, so no, it, it's, <laughs> it's not. The he got the counter hit up four three. Almost got nice. into the wall. Oh! Big bodies. Ooh, he almost went and he almost let that unblockable. He probably could have gotten go. it too. <laughs> he had three out of the four rotations. Yes, he did. You saw the little glow going. Mm -hmm. We were about to see life flash before our eyes with that kick. 
Oh, nice knockdown. Ooh. Tigers are not going to be either to the wall. It's going to break the wall. Oh, it didn't break it. Nope. I'm surprised. Yeah, me too, actually. Pretty fragile Great for though. centuries old marble. <laughs> Subway on the red dress. Got to make something happen. Went for the jailing string and uh, Tigers were not biting. Yep. Playing very conservative here. Oh, he got the clap. <laughs> that statement is so bad. Oh, he got up. Got <laughs> oh, he's going he's for it. He's going for the rage. Oh, oh, he missed. missed. But he gets the round on life. Oh, he oh, hopped oh, over and get tough. Oh, shit. Round three. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I need to change my pants. What the <laughs> fuck just happened? Get out of here, Subway. <laughs> Step it up, Suzaku. Let's go. Jockey in for position. I'm surprised the there's not more hype about that in the, in the chat. I'm honestly disappointed in you people. They are so stoic in the chat right now. You saw a neutral hop kick from nowhere. Oh, oh. He did nice. it again. Look at this. You got to get him to the wall. Yep. Nope. It's a Mortal Kombat. You could die on those uh, on, the, on that fence. There's the debug. Hey, round debug? three. Saw a debug. Debug. Count him. Take, put the counter up. Put the, put the counter up. The, the debug. Screen. Damn, the hitbox on that down forward two is crazy. Speaking of that, Asuka and Jack in particular have really goofy phantom mm. hitboxes on their down forward two. Gets the bear hug though. Yeah. Okay, goes with the oh, uh, the, the right. bow flex. Put his hands in the tie dye on that one. Wow, oh, he he with punish that one four. That's ooh, gonna take ooh. him to the wall. So it's gonna be it. Oh ooh, no, he didn't make it. Good throw Wall break, though, save Tiger. Tigers or Dare. Oh, no. No, we don't like uh -oh. seeing that. Okay. Ooh. Uh, so Ooh. Almost saw a desync. I guess Tekken didn't like uh, seeing a Japanese girl get tackled by a robot. <laughs> this is against the, the programming that Harada-san has instilled in me. <laughs> <laughs> don't ask me for shit. <laughs> there are no leaks. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't deliver it even if I could. <laughs> oh, look at the banner in the chat. Subway, tell him about himself. You took that match with authority. Oh. Neutral hop kick to, to solidify yourself back in. And then you were with punish and stuff Man. with down four two. Ooh. Kev, how do how's that how's that crow taste? How you how you feel? <laughs> it's Asuka and he was optimal. That's a sick burn and for, for the folks at home, that's a sick burn in Tekken lingo. If you call somebody not optimal, you might as well have done a yo mama joke. That's for real, like talking about your mom and your grandmother and your dead grandmother. <laughs> like both of them on your mother and your dad's side. You say somebody's not optimal, oh. <laughs> as Comatose would say, you're getting hands. Yep. That's villager speak. Villager talk. <laughs> that's plus two. <laughs> Only villagers don't know that. <laughs> it's like, bro, Only that's villagers. a really obscure combination of moves. Everybody uh, villagers nah. compared to me. Only villagers don't know. <laughs> <laughs> don't know, bro. You don't know. Tiger Zord switching to Devil Jin. Yeah. So I've I've seen Tiger Zord using Devil Jin before, and it's it's different, you know, especially when you talk about the type of style yeah. it takes to play Asuka versus the amount of, of time you have to put in to really get a maximizing power of Devil Jin. I mean, because yeah. he's got incredible tools, but you really have to be on top of your game execution wise. One of the few projectile heavy uh or, or projectile capable characters in the game. Laser beams. Yep. Let's see it. See a lot of wake up flying. I'm sure. Fight. This game's, if this game were more slightly more Japanese, he'd be shouting laser beams every time he shot them. Oh God! Every move would have a superhero name to it. Okay, so they're just kind of oh electrics doing a lot of movement. We saw an electric there. I like it. Challenge him at the wall. That move is super negative. It could be punished hella hard at oh, the wall. Ooh, there we go. There's that pressure you like the to elbow. see out of, out of Jack. Yes. He's got a lot Using of all the pedigree. Moves. Man, oh. he he blocked that down back one. Good lord, that's such a hard low. Oh, big low for uh, Jack Seven's game here. Nice back step out of that throw attempt. Okay, another electric. Okay, just going for basic uh, string mix-ups yep. there. Oh, he's Ooh, off his feet. Counter hit. Oh, so Tiger Sword's got advantage. the red dress on. Ten seconds left. Ooh, getting hit by the second hit. Don't. Went for the Columbus kip up, and it did not work. Just like the Bengals offensive line. Let's go. Ooh, Bengals burn. Bengals burn. And that's an old school Bengals fan that's talking. 
Whoa! Ooh. Karate Chop. Yeah, Subway actually loves using Karate Chop. On hit, you do get additional damage. Wow, went for the electric. Didn't yeah. uh, drop the combo there. Yeah, kind of... I'm interested in what Tiger Zord's overall game plan is here with, with Devil Jim, because it doesn't seem like he's doing anything especially... Like no, and you know what's, what's particularly like nerve-wracking is they're both kind of sitting at that that little sweet spot between one and two. They mm -hmm. both have incredibly reaching tools, and he gets launched just like that. Yep. Doesn't get the wall though. Misses the stomp. That could have been a big chance for Tiger Zord. Yeah. Say Tiger Zord could probably stand to go on offense a little bit more. He's, he's Man, kinda... the oh, and this match, ooh, got there the we... winged fly. Oh, this could be it. Rage Arts. Wow, he missed that hell sweep oh, by a mile. Oh, oh. Yo, didn't, we, didn't need to knock him out. You can win on time. We're, we're, he could have. He could have done that. Yeah, we're we're seeing some timeouts here. Yeah, giving him the sloosh. God, karate chop looks nasty. It is a horrid move to get hit by. <laughs> Going for that string again. Gotta say, Tiger Sword's defense is is stepping up as he goes along, though. We're we're seeing a lot of the ancient pedigree Ooh. here. Okay, finally gets a combo off the electric yeah. wind. Nice pickup. Oh, we went to the wall, but nothing coming out of it. Oh, he had the sidestep there. Wasn't uh, oh. wasn't sure about himself. Okay, just kind of keeping up at the wall. Backs off. Ah, uh, of course goes he goes for the low. double hit. That move is actually really ambiguous to block if you don't know. Oh, I, I bet it is. It looks like somewhere between a low and a mid. It, it looks like a mid, but it is definitely a low on that second hit. Oh, it didn't finish oh, that string. No. I think he knew. He Sub knew. Yep. Subway knew exactly where to where to uh, interrupt the rest of that. Look at the timer. Oh, oh Six seconds. Oh, oh my oh, gosh. Oh, Can is he, he going to control this help? for the rest of the time? Oh, my God. Oh, does he have it? Oh, oh, Tiger oh, Zord. Oh, oh. oh, and Subway all He was mad. like, I didn't lose that round. Get this <laughs> volcano buster, bitch. <laughs> oh, he went for the backswing. Oh, there Hell we go. Sweet. There's Tatsu. Oh, missed the second hit for the combo there. That was a good roll. Seeing a lot of uh, tentative play here. They're not real sure of themselves. Yep. Butchering these Ooh. characters. Elbow into a low. Don't do blue stuff here. We don't do that. Nope. Oh, oh caught oh, him with that. No, he didn't do geez. low, but didn't finish the combo, though. Oh, yep. See, he knows the combo for that string. Yikes. Oh, look at him. Wow, he saw the this. kip up. Damn, he saw there that it is, low debug. Final round. All right, this is match point for Subway Wang. Tiger Zord's going to have to make something happen here. ASAP. Come on, level up the Kudons. Gets the Hell Sweep. This is a good start. Gets to the wall. Okay, basic. Oh. Check him in mid, low. Check your ankles. Very patient play. Got to oh, yeah. keep the pressure on. Oh, We're 20 oh, seconds uh -oh. in. Can't take too many of those, though, there, uh, Tiger. Yes, that the mm. pressure from the elbow adds up. Ooh, that back one hits hard. Yeah. Back one of four. I don't know what sure it is. Ooh, really being saved there. By, by Subway not picking up the, uh, the OTGs. There we go. Debug. De Look at him just standing there. The yeah. confidence in Subway got, right now. Got the rage. We got the Rajay. So you might have rage on, but you're still getting this foot long, sir. 15 seconds. Ooh. Who's going to make the move? Is Tiger Zord going home, or is Subway going to take this? Oh, he's down. And that's and he's it. He's done. Tiger Zord gets duffed to oblivion. <laughs> so we had we had three debugs all together, right? Uh, I think it was. Debug counter. I think it was three or yeah. four. Yep, yep. 3.5 if you count a bunch of the lows that he did. Bonk. Pretty good. All right, so. Subway Wang with the 2-0 victory is going to move on to losers finals against RTK. TNA. And they settled it like men. They just yeah. uh, gave each other the GGs and went about with their business. So, just trying to invite, trying to invite our teammate to the fight. Leave me alone, Tekken UI. I didn't do anything to you. So we're gonna have our teammate versus Subway Wang. All right, this is losers final. So of course this is uh, best of five. Three out of five. Mm -hmm. Subway gonna stick with uh, Jack, or we're gonna see the the goofy Juilliard again. What's it gonna be, Mr. Wang? You're not gonna tell me. You keep it a mystery. 
I'm just saying I would, playing to the crowd. I don't know what it might be. You're gonna see another character from someone in Ohio? Oh! From someone in Ohio. Oh, Subway's out to bite everyone's style. It'll probably be some goofy like Armor King or Don Ryu. <laughs> Watch, it's Don Ryu. It's probably Don Ryu. <laughs> the sky. It could have multiple interpretations. That's oh, a really Claudio. I don't even know. Yeah, you could play Claudio. I know you got a pocket Claudio. I did invite our teammate, right? We all, we all saw me do this. Hashtag amnesia for matchstick, because I don't remember either. I'll do it again. Fuck <laughs> yuck. Yuck. There, for real, we pick Panda. <laughs> I want to see the volleyball. Let's go. Make oh, sure dude. Panda's not on the little uh, yes. bathing suit skirt. Can we get, can it's got to be Panda? totally Kwai. Want... Yeah, do Panda. Can, can we do uh, Can we do Alex? The. Uh... Oh, man. That makes me miss, miss Roger Jr., for real. I loved Roger. Artsy Nate, where are you? Artsy Nate, you were in the building and now you're not here. You got to play your natch, next match, sir. When are they adding Sagat to Tekken 7? Sagat, uh, oh my Fakun god. Ramen. <laughs> they do have Fakun Ram, which they already have mods for Sagat. It's true. When's the next Village Hall meeting? Uh, it's whenever you, Fuyu, and Kevin get together and talk about this game. Maybe Johnny. Oh, anytime heard, you throw Johnny into the I mix. Haven't heard, I haven't heard anything from Maldonado in a long time. There he is. Dag, you know what? That you're right. What's who? Who knows what's going on with Johnny M? Where has he been? What's he been up to? I haven't even seen him on Facebook. Memes on Facebook is what he's been up to. I know he's been doing a lot of thirst posts. <laughs> it's haven't been a hidden. All. It's been a, a minute though. It's hard to it's hard to meet it's hard to meet people under normal circumstances in this crazy modern world, let alone yeah. during quarantine. Oh God, yes, the threat of a really, really, really unpredictable uh, virus that's afoot right now. Yeah. God, I won't take that chance at all. Yeah, seriously. Okay, like, so we're in our losers final, right? Subway Wang and Artsy Nate. First I'm going back to three. for a second interview on a for a job and. Uh, Right now, it's only like four people deep, and I'm like, yes, that seems like the perfect amount where I can Hell successfully yeah. avoid others throughout the most hey. of my day. Positivity, man. Yep. You, you can, you're going to get it. You're going to get it, King. I, I think they like me. I, I, think it, I think it's pretty much a shoe in kind of thing, but yeah. Just give them the, the, give them the old winky dink and uh, <laughs> show your charm off. Be like, uh, hi, uh, I'm here That might be a little interview. too American for them. I'm, I'm gonna, too American? We'll, we'll Whoa, too. so we're seeing two completely different deviations Ooh. here. Ooh. Nate going with the boxer. The boxer. Steve. Steve. Not Minecraft, Steve. This one got to keep his meat. <laughs> this this Steve actually <laughs> boxes. Instead of plays with boxes. <laughs> Blocks or boxes? Which one is it? Give him the dense Dempsey roll. Exactly. Dude, you got to give him the Dempsey, Dempsey roll. Non c'è spazio per il round one. <laughs> I was in a JoJo Pot 5. <laughs> How about you, sir? Pugilism. I think you've got the, uh, oh yeah, you do got the names reversed. Okay, good deal. Yep, yep, I got it. Subway, preparing to go to the disco. Gonna Just got even on Reynolds life here. And do, a ton of, do a ton of drugs. <laughs> a ton of drugs. Make sure you chew gum the whole time. Exactly. Open mouth chewing. Man, no just completely him, battered him to the ground. We didn't even get, uh... 30 seconds oh. into that. Very, very different match set from yeah. uh, the last set where we were going almost to the end of the round. All right. So th this is a tribute to Ryan H. Is what, is what we're seeing here from Subway. Oh, yes. Ryan H. simps for Claudio. <laughs> to be fair, you know, Ryan H. is the, uh, the res resident Claudio here in Columbus. Mm -hmm. um, we do have a couple others that lurk around in Cincinnati and Ohio. I think there is even one in uh, Columbus, too. There is. Uh, that is uh, Sammy Ayash, otherwise known as uh, XDSC Crunk. Yep. And we also got in Cincinnati the uh, the ever-present in the background, Apocrypha, one of the best Claudios I know of. Very, very nasty player. 
my senpai as well. Ah. Alright. Oh. Okay, gets a simple ball damage. Yeah. Went for the, uh, the the blue spark mid. Oh, we're going, we're going for that uh, for that run and B. Running, oh. running two, I guess. Oh. Gets the shoulder there. Very nice delay on that to confirm the hit on that wall splat. Nicely Th done. This entire match is just a JoJo, like, no stand battle. <laughs> Just make sure you do really goofy poses that would break your back. Uh, Claudio's got that Gets covered. counter hit by the high. Oh, hell yeah. He's got the back Oh, win for the low there. Maybe it was some sort of an oh. Oki by doing that. <laughs> wow. Throwing out the hot kicks. There are a lot of trades going on in this match. Yeah, it's hard to say which, which one it works for. Okay. Nate making a statement here. Oh, he could have been launched for throwing that out. Nate had a little flash of aggression there, but wow. came back to hurt oh, That him. was a huge combo. Yeah, it came, he came back immediately. They were swinging for the fences for sure. Sammy Subway quickly making a statement. Nice. No, Tekken, I don't want to play. God. I don't own you to play you. Why do you sound so soft saying that? <laughs> I don't want to play. <gasps> Why does everything you say sound so soft? <laughs> I love that you know that reference. Oh my gosh. That is such a good song. I love that video. I'm about to be professional. Homie, I'm professional. And then uh, like, like a deep voice thing. I don't know, maybe. Like, man, that shit is <laughs> Make a hook garbage. song. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, there might have been an upside to it. I, I don't know. Uh, I'm not usually good making up stuff on the spot like that. Don't you guys usually like outsource that, you know, sometimes? Man, whatever. <laughs> The fans of rap and the anti-rap. <laughs> trying to get you trying to get high? What right now? Yeah. Oh sure. <laughs> that just seems like a, a lot. lot right now. <laughs> <laughs> head? <laughs> I knew your dirty little ass wants some head. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Okay, so Artsy taking away his uh investment in Steve mm. and putting it back into Paul. Look at the hair. We got two <laughs> stylish hair dudes. Angry guilish hair very guileish hair you'd think he'd have some big powerful move like a death fist oh wait he does changing it to arctic snowfall dude wouldn't it be great if like uh 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 kengen ashura came out with a tekken style game holy yeah. shit fight. with working hitboxes yes. sign me up not not an arena fighter a real game <laughs> that terrifies me. Ooh, Ryan being confident here and saying, hey, punish Death Fist with back four two, son. Let's see if he can do it. RT has not been afraid to throw out Death Fist, so no. uh, he's going to get a good chance to work on his punishes if he's uh, cognizant enough. One nice thing about Paul is you don't need the wall. No, damage <laughs> happens anywhere. Damage just happens You want that to go? To it's the hop kick. Good oh, carry. the combo dropped there, but it Ooh. picked him up anyway. Let me tell you about my favorite movie, Operation Dumbo Drop. <laughs> Get to this backhand, the Bertoli. Round two. Fight. They've got to be cold out there, I'm just saying. I mean, Paul's fighting barefoot yeah, in the snow. Paul, maybe. I don't getting know. That's, frostbit. that's probably full leather that Claudio's got on, so he's probably fine. It's non breathable leather, so it like scrunches as he moves. Exactly. So. And the melted snow is Ooh. getting in through his, uh, his leather shoelets. Okay, he got hit by the uh, third hit of that string. Nice confirm. Doesn't finish it. Yeah, we got fights in the field. We got fights in the chat. What up? <laughs> For real, it's getting a little hostile in here. Telling each other, telling each other to square, square up. up. Look at this Ooh. close range pressure from Subway. That's good God, good. just kind of stifling him. Yeah, he tried two? to take his turn yeah. out of fear and Subway just punished him for it. We saw the death fist. He didn't punish it. Didn't matter, though. Backhanding him again. Yeah, the crazy pimp slap. <laughs> Where's my money, man whore? Hey, I'm calling it right now. Subway's got to do the uh, unblockable nut fondle. It's mm. got to happen. I'm, I, I request it. Dig deep. Touch the darkness within him. Oh, he didn't punish that death fist. Doesn't matter. Oh, he almost got the twin pistons there. Yeah. Nothing came from it. And they're being really cautious for Paul right now. Oh, got the counter hit. Nice there combo. Go. He's gonna hurt a lot. Blue stuff. Yeah. Like, I'm so strong. I get some of the blue stuff whenever I want. Ugh. 
about just about even on life here. There are yeah. 20 seconds uh, left in the match. Yeah, uh, Subway's got to press the advantage. Uh oh, oh, okay. Got the blue stuff. Doesn't matter. Yo, was Doesn't that hammer of the gods? Dropped. That looked a little hammer of the gods. Fight. Not the hammer. I, you know what? We'll just call it the hammer of the gods. Sure. Not the hammer of the gods. You know what? I don't care. Oh, he didn't. Uh, didn't want to go for that second hit. I only know Paul moves from uh, from a card game where Tekken was the, the featured uh, IP. They actually had a card game for that. Oh yeah, so right. artsy Nate. Very different oh. uh, round here from yeah. the last one. Good start. Oh, the trade and Nate's first to the fire. Wow, okay. sending a message. We're, I mean, literally 20 seconds and it's gone. Yeah, this could be Paul where really capable doing around. big damage. Oh, right off the speed. Up, oh. turn the favor. Gets him with the pickup. Okay, trying to catch him with Samoki there. He's yep. got the blue stuff. Ooh, nice. The one, Demo two, man. Yeah, do that again. Make Another it a repeat. Yep. Bit, bop, boom. Demo man, not the blue this time. Putting Subway on the ropes right uh, now. Ah, he Ooh, went for that it. was a big whip. What, what, what do you say, kids? Ball fondlers? Ball fondlers? Needs the ball fondling. I'm just saying, <laughs> massage is gonna have to happen. You you gotta send that message because you dropping the round like that. That's tough, and especially yeah. that string. Blocking that string, you get the stagger block. That's big damage if you block that. But we're online, so you have to take it with a grain of salt. Exactly. But yeah, so the card game it was called um, uh, UFS or Universal Fighting System, and uh, they brought in a ton of fighting game IPs uh, to be to, to, you know just be things that you could do with these cards. And the idea was that you were basically playing a universal fighting game. So Mugen, basically. Mugen the card game. Mm. You would you would pick a character, you would slap them down, that's who you're playing. They have character specific abilities on the card, and you would play cards from your hand, and you would do attacks, and you could do more attacks based on how many, like, cards you kind of had, like your mana pool, and, and all this. I'm, I'm being very general, but yeah. Uh, it was yeah, it couldn't be like Mugen though, because Mugen you would you could make characters like you know Dark Iori or Violent Ken, like just cr true, true. crazy true. characters. And this you could have like uh, it was all like a, a resource matching, so you could have Chun Li. Uh, sorry, you could have uh, Ivy uh, 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 throwing Hadoukens and Chun Li wielding Soul Calibur. I'm down for that. Yeah, thick thighs and swords. Let's mm -hmm. go. But yeah, my favorite characters were like Lizard Man, Adon. Um, uh, who else? Sophidia, of course, because that's my girl. Um, I actually got into Nats with a Chun Li. Um, almost got top eights for Nats. I got kicked out for diversity. Um, that's a weird statement with no context. So at the I time, got kicked out for diversity. Well, at, at the time, if there were like two of like essentially the same character deck, uh, in a in a in a final in a top eight, they would kick out the lowest ranked one. Oh, okay. yeah, because it was like, oh, we don't want the, the meta getting stale. I'm like, I play Nobody likes stale else. meta. No, yeah. Not me. No. So it wouldn't happen in a real fighting game tournament. They were like, oh, too many Zangiefs. Like, what do you have no, to go no. for? No. <laughs> What's your way out of this building? Subway Wang sticking with Claudio. Yeah. I like the commitment. No farmy Round one. Oh, the Black Death Key. Fight. Black Death. One is too many Zangies. So a Twilight Conflict. They're both just uh, happy to just exchange some uh, feelers here. Mm -hmm. Remember, we still got two matches, maybe three more to play. Yeah, this could go to game five. Right now, things are riding about even. Nice damage. Ooh, Holy cow. Big wall splat. Ooh. Blocks that first hit and didn't think he was going to follow up with that. Yeah. We've, we've seen uh, Artsy really make that string work. He's so even got used that to great, great effect against competitive casual. There it is again, essentially. Just kind of floated him out of the air. Yeah, yeah now it's, now it's Subway who really has to focus on, uh, on what they're doing. Whoa. Ooh, good Win grab. with the parry. Ooh, boy. Death, Death is. Do it again. Ooh, oh. threw it out there. He burned that rage drive early. I'm uh, sure I'm, I'm, I'm not not a particular fan of that. Still wow. Got the blue sparks, though. There it is. Gets him with the the mid mid string. Bop. Wow, that was a straight up bop. I don't care what the actual name is. That's that's Paul's bop. That's a boop. Call that a boop. That's the running two. Bopper. <laughs> Sock <'em> boppers. <laughs> Plus frames. More fun than a pillow fight. Gets the wall break. Is he gonna get him to the other wall? We're going wall to wall. Mm, 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 mm. Get this damage. Ooh. Ugh. 
of Riva Derchi. Yo. Took that man on a, on a ride and still got the perfect. Nice. Gave him a tour, counter hit. All the things working in Subway's favor right now. There we are. Can he keep that up? He's got to punish that death fist. That's a big mm. move to let Paul get away with. I'll tell you what. That, so much damage. That three hit combo, well, it's, it's all keyed into that very fast low strike at the start. Demo man, yeah, you live and die by that sword. Oh, oh, wow, oh. it's the pickup. Subway has to make something happen here to survive. He's got the red dress. He's 30 seconds. Stuff. He's got all the blue stuff. Plus frames. Oh, oh, oh the shoulder. He just took Silenced a little, him. little too long getting back into it. RT Nate up to one right now. Yeah. Game three was uh, pretty decisive, I would say. So can he clutch it out in this this next game, or will Subway give in and switch? Or is he gonna stick out with the committal? Uh, but yeah, Subway, it is it is first to three. Yes, you still have more games to play. Is he gonna there. unveil? Is the he gonna unveil? Yeah. I'm not, the I'm, I know, like what what's the what's he what's he gonna do? Is he gonna go back to his to his tried and true? Is he gonna go back to his main or is he gonna try to dunk on the community a little more? <laughs> the audience is waiting with bated breath right now. Come on, Subway, whip out another character they, they they're gonna say you don't know how to play. Just milking the timer on the character select <laughs> and the stage set. Mm, one day Namco will just install a retry button on the on the, the game over UI. <laughs> you mean use effective UI? Who does that? Not me. That's dumb. Rematch says Harada. Who would ever play Tekken more than once? <laughs> I don't play it. I don't play it more than once. That's bananas. And here we go. Yep. Stained glass Leo. Let's go. So what was looking to be just a, you know a casual night with a little bit of a side tournament in Tekken has now become. Serious. It really has. Subway's see Subway. For his life. Subway combo video wang. Let's go. <laughs> Subway Jack Seven Master Wang. Yeah, Master Wang. <laughs> that sounds really bad. This is Master Pain. Don't call him anything other than Betty or I'll cut off your big toe. <laughs> <laughs> was that have you not seen kung pao do you know how long it's been since i've seen kung pao oh, i mean dude. out of all the old shit we've talked about once a year for me easily mm. gets him with the counter hit he knows how to confirm Ooh, that yeah hell sweep See, now, archie's now got it back to the wall now we got a full yeah you know, we got we got a fully functional leo rather than a than a side piece Claudia. Yeah, we're seeing seeing a very different style. A lot, a lot more comfort in uh, Subway's play. Gets him with the knee. Almost got him to the wall. Oh, this is a run back too. This was this was uh, winner's uh, semis. Oh God, that's right. Ooh. There's that trip. Archie, Archie just having his way, putting in the mix on. Is it going to be a mid or is, is Demo Man coming out? Oh. First stance there. Nothing happened. No duck on the second hit. Hammer oh, of the man. gods. That was a nice sidestep. Didn't really get much out. Wow. Wow. He just followed that this uppercut made, straight into the sky. He got down forward two did into oblivion from that. Oh, tried to go for pressure there, RC. Mm. Really doing well with moving away from any of the pressure yeah. Subway wants to bring out. I love that his death fist moves like Paul away. Like a block death fist uh. makes Paul retreat. We saw the, the classical play there of Paul going into strings and then yep. throwing out the big shoulder, catching Subway off guard. Subway. Yep. So Subway's has really got to gotta put, focus. Got to put all his quarters down. Yeah, match point right now. Nate could uh, take this and go on to fight competitive casual again. You can feel the suspense. Subway wants to make a launcher happen. Mm -hmm. Has to make it. Get oh. the damage to balance it out. Death fist. Stop. Getting pressured at the wall. He's got the red dress. Subway can make something happen here with one oh, good launch. Oh man! Oh, I got interrupted out of trying to do a stance there. We yep. seen we didn't see the the actual stances working in uh, Subway's favor in this because RT Nate just making it a point to challenge every single action Subway Absolutely. took. Absolutely. Well, 
Good stuff, Subway. Sorry it didn't work out for you, but hey, congratulations to Artsy Nate, who's going to move on to Grand Finals against the Casual. Artsy's going to get his run back. Can he he reset it against the Juggernaut? (laughs) Competitive Casual. The old man Juggernaut at that. On someone, bitch. Old man Casual. He's got a bad hip. Come on, Artsy. You can do it. (laughs) Go for the hip. He's, he's got a bad hip, and you might catch him like when he's changing a diaper. Go he's taking care of kids, yes. Get him while he's holding the infant. That always works for me. Oh, Artsy left That never really doesn't. That's very cool. Yeah, Artsy's got to come back in here. Artsy, you're not done yet. Come back here for more punishment. And now you gotta, now you got to do the sadist thing and fight the competitive casual exactly. one more time. So I wonder if we're going to see... I him sticking gonna... with Paul, or is he going to try Eddie again? Or I mean, do we? Does he have other characters that he can actually try in this match? Who is who is the Sloosh going to play? Mm. Sloosh. Well, you know, so we saw with the previous match that he had against Artsy Nate that he had a lot of success with using Lily. We saw the first mm-hmm. match where it, it looked a little bit more like it go it could go either way based off how Artsy Nate was playing, and then it quickly changed after that. We saw a lot of download and adaptation happen on competitive casuals part so are we going to see a continuation of that is this going to be a duality a trilogy what's going on (laughs) oh wait i see a i see a a kazumi in the uh in the character slot what's happening with that he's he's got a high ranking kazumi as well he used to play a lot of kazumi competitive casual actually has a lot of characters under his belt kazumi asuka lisa Paul, uh, oh God, Miguel. I mean, he, he has an absolutely gargantuan list of characters he can capably play. This is this is uh, Slush's first Kazumi, twice removed. Twice removed. <laughs> Grandma Kazumi. Are we going to see her appear? Is it going to be the raven-haired Lily again? Oh, yeah. Somebody's coming out with raven hair. That's all I can tell I, you. I, yeah, someone's going to have black hair on Slush's side. Of the If there's one thing you can tell that's going to be consistent out of this entire set with Sloosh, that's going to be someone with black hair. So here we go. Egyptian Spider Woman. (laughs) Spider Woman. Bunny hop into victory. (laughs) Grand finals. Artsy Nate going with the boxer himself, asking if she wants to go. Lily has no idea what he's saying because she don't speak English. She's French. She speaks a little English. A little English. I mean, she has to. Got to vary up her intellect a little bit, I'm sure. I mean, you know, coming from a big wealthy family, oh, probably yeah, knows a couple languages. Yeah, I mean, she like she probably has to like talk to international like debutantes and crap all the time. Diplomats, you know, yeah, international yeah. affairs. This there is we how go. she greets them. Fight. So here we go. Boxer. Ooh, artsy coming out of the gym gate first. We're seeing him in the Forbidden Temple, so we could see uh, floor breaks come into play here. Mm-hmm. Who's going to take advantage of it first? Oh, good slide in. Took 10 seconds before we saw some damage start appearing. And that throw is huge damage. Big command grab damage. Ooh. Oh. Didn't confirm the second hit, but he's just putting mixes out there. Yep. Nice. Wow. Ducked in his face. Yep. The cojones. And we haven't even seen a floor break yet. It's coming. No floor breaks at all. Yes. Oh, tried to punish that and uh, wasn't fast enough on the draw. Nope. Big whiff. That's dangerous. Oh, yeah. All right. Nate trying to do a little bob and weave. Takes a wow. sloosh off his feet. There Four we break go. Time. There we go. Keep it going. Wow, she just teleported back oh. into front facing position. <laughs> Immediately. Yes, the side switch. Very evident here. Good punish on competitive casuals part. All right. Cash tried to get the with long slide. Nate with the, with the comeback. I may not know much, but I know when to punish. Good throw, Doc. Hey, good throw, wow, that was a clutch launch there. It could have could have actually broken the wall. Let's sure he ducked the throw. Oh, oh. Wow. Give Gotta the see more. <laughs> wow, the punch parry. Yep. Throw break. Ten seconds. Oh, wow, he's going to die. Freeze. Oh, he got it. Oh, my gosh. Kiss the fist. Boom. Look at the wrist. Look at the wrist. <laughs> he matched that rage art out. I love it. Saying, so, you know what? I don't have to respect you. Nope. Goes for the slidey. Doesn't punish the hot kick. Says, you're Lily, you're not even good. 
One, two, threes. Throw oh, breaking. Nice break, yeah. When's the next floor break happening? You tell me. Straight up the white fang. That, that, that oh. down up combo. We're not about the combos here. Do the back one counter hit. Oh, that's a stand maneuver. Sorry, wow. sir. You gotta, you gotta block that high. Looking like an American reset. So competitive casual up two one in yep. this first game in our grand finals. Time to steer Nate towards that uh, crack in the floor. Staying away from the broken floor panels. It's got to be expensive to fix. <laughs> Groundsman's angry. Says get out of here. We already I had evil beasts. I don't need you guys fighting here. Are willing. <laughs> like you guys couldn't find a bar or something? What's the matter with you? There is no bar setting in Tekken, is there? We traveled 3,000 miles to fight in an old decrepit temple. Oh, okay. Just, just jabs me yeah, through the red dress. Yeah, one. Not even, not even running one, just run up one. Oh, wow. the punch parry punch parry the shove? Oh my gosh. Casual, just, just letting Ooh. him kind of throw moves out there. That's a really bad Superman punch. Yes, it, it's very linear. You can sidestep, and considering you're looking at one of the best sidestepping characters in the game in Lily, her movement is impeccable. Very few characters can outmaneuver her. But that is one for competitive casual, who I will remind you is the uh, the winner's side champion, so he only needs to win one best of five set to uh, solidify his title. Nate would have to do a reset with a three out of five and then win another three out of five. Marcy Nate's really got his work cut out cut out for him to uh, try to bring this back. Six sets starting now. Or He's got to punch the wall. Yeah. He's going to have to punch the wall that is competitive casual in this. Get the damage out there. Don't be afraid. Just put your fist through it like... Uh... Oh, crap. What's that girl's name from The Boys? Oh, I haven't seen that show yet. Oh, I've watched so much television, oh, but I have not watched that yet. I, so I will good. boldly admit that. It's so good. So is he going to stick with Steve? Or are we going to see the Paul? He had some pretty good success with Paul, so I'm wondering if we'll see we'll see the American Fist come out. Starlight, that's her name. Yeah. Starlight. Okay, okay. I actually know who that character is. Yep. I've seen an episode of it. First, I haven't yeah, watched the entire thing, but I've seen enough. Who who practices by beating up their own garage? That's what I want to know. <laughs> uh, I guess if you're a superhero, you can practice on whatever you want. Yeah, or in so Street Fighter's watch. case, you just punch a car. Yeah. This seems like a safe place to park, right here by the water. <laughs> what are you doing? That's my car. my car! That was my sob, you asshole. That's the same uh, guy from Final Fight, because that the, the beat up the car thing originated there. Yep. Shout out to Final Fight. That was such a good sense. Here we go. The Shima Dojo. RC Nate sticking with Steve. Checked him on the mid there. Casual knows oh, that punish. Nice pickup. That OTG was light. Oh! Oh. Oh, Nate. Nate for that doesn't catch that. Yeah, Nate didn't get the good follow up off that. That second hit actually doesn't work if you just stay down. If you actually tech roll that, it hits. But if you stay down, it will not hit you. Oh, that is some good insight from Sloosh, though. Wow, almost got counter hit out of that string. Okay, Straight backing off here. Yeah, jacking, yeah. jockeying for position. Yeah, casual doing some godlike side steps. Oh, gets caught. Really got some timing here. He could have cashed out more in the combo, but doesn't. Breaks the throw. Mm -hmm. Big time to do it. Good stuff. Oh, and I know, he almost caught him out of the air. Very unlucky on Artsy's part. Round three. Fight. Competitive casual quickly up two rounds in this second game. Yes, he is. All right, there we go. Nice gut check. Trying to get something happen here. Artsy, got to gotta change it up. I like the light stomp that he does for the OTG. Casual, just com just content to back off, but he was smothering him with pressure just seconds earlier. Yep. Gets the low. I thought a counter hit was coming. There oh, was the matter. Oh, there's a grab. Oh. Punishes with throw. We're in dead or alive now. Tried to punch parry. You can't right. punch parry knees. Wow, Double did it twice. You win. This uh, this set's looking a little suspect. Yeah. Can RT Nate pull himself together? Yeah. That looked a little more tilted than the first one. Black's a little sus. 
Austin. Austin's a little sus. I think I think Sloosh is the killer. <laughs> <laughs> He's the imposter. He's the imposter. The rest of us are human. I was doing my task in electrical. <laughs> that was an O2. Whenever, whenever, <laughs> whenever anybody says anything, you're always an O2. I saw Sluice come out of the vents. Oh yeah, no, he was venting. He was venting. I saw him on cams. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Sluice is up two games to zero in this grand final. Art, putting Artsy in the corner. Most people only have one game. Competitive casual have two games. Competitive two casual games. is game fuckboy. Hiya, hiya. <laughs> Wheel. Uh, it's feeling like Artsy's gonna have to uh, come up with a miracle to to break down this entire barrier that Casual has right now. He had he was doing so good with uh, Paul earlier. Okay. And that initial set. Okay, so we went with Eddie with this. So here's the thing: if he's gonna make this comeback, he is locked in for Eddie for the rest yep. of this set. Which could be a long time from now or cleaning up in the next 45 seconds. <laughs> it's a long haul. We're talking Lord of the Rings style long haul. Yeah. And there are no eagles. No eagles. No, you're going to have to deal with every single area you go through. Even the ones the movie didn't cover. So many second breakfasts. Gabe play. Hype to see Eddie coming out. <laughs> Will Artsy show up and show out. Gabe, Here we go in Hammerhead. Gabe, what is what is this heel turn? You were you were saying Eddie was cheap earlier, and now you're happy to see him. Going with the classic Eddie too. I love that costume. Uh, that is, yeah, that's straight up classic Eddie with his uh, his Cordotis. Or yeah, cor, cor, wait. The Cordonis, Fesca. Yeah. I feel like that's a soft drink. Gets him with the kip up. Just about even on life. They're in the middle yep. of the arena. Oh. Nice. Nate coming in Check low. Gets the spring kick. Sluice tried to hop kick through it and got kicked, but it doesn't matter. He got him with back turn. Went for the snake edge. Ow, wee. Ooh, to the wall. She said mapesh and shoved him <laughs> right down his throat. <laughs> Round two. She's like, you can't come get me with these Martian Manhunter boots. So we're seeing a very interesting contrast between these two characters. Lily is an excellent sidestepping character, and Eddie has a great backdash. Will RC will use that. Gets the generic throw. He also covers a lot of uh, both horizontal and vertical ground when he finally gets his uh, his pattern going. Absolutely. Gets something going here. Oh, doesn't doesn't finish the combo though. Oh wow. And and just casual knows exactly where those kicks are flying. He just did that straight oh, yeah. up duck punish. He recognized that mid high string, which is a popular one for Eddie's. Mm -hmm. Sloosh knew it, so just like that, he's on the verge of taking this set. Yep, tournament point right here. Oh, there we go. Oh, There's he got punish. low. Getting onto the start of something oh. beautiful, but not with the drop like that. Give him a gift card. What are we doing? Jab him. We're not going nice. to Subway. Solid Get the hands. Oh, again. Slow Nate has been making that chip up work very uh, well. The spring kick. Oh, he dropped the combo. I guess he wasn't yeah. confident in it. All right, looks like Sloosh is adapted to the... Oh, uh, he threw out the Rage Arc. Could just yeah. take the risk. Oh, he should have punished him harder for that. You don't let anybody get away with the Rage Arc. Uh, How dare you? Not a blocked Rage Arc. But so he, he took that round, Artsy. Fighting for his life. Ooh. He's got the full on LeBron James cry. Fighting for my life. Fighting for my life. Y'all are killing me. <laughs> Just staying in the middle, yep. working Ooh. the neutral. Gets a good follow up. Casual gets right to the point. Go through the classic slippery kicks. Good lord. Doesn't get him to the wall though. Nice clip there. Oh, he finished it. Off oh, the wall. wall spot. He was lucky he was uh, facing yeah. the wall there. Sloosh was right up. He was not going to get pinned. Wow. Nope. Broke the throw. That was clutch. Oh, he you know, he's barely got oh, away. No. Plus frames. It's Don't get greedy. We're almost there. Artsy Nate has to do something. He cannot let Sloosh get anything. Oh, oh. Oh, no. Oh, oh he blocked the low. Oh, my God. Oh. No. Oh. And so Nate, competitive casual takes it. Nate almost could have squeaked that around. He almost, almost did, and then he, then he rotated around, yeah. his body to the exact position where Lily could nail him in the balls. 
Ugh, in the bowels. Oh, but that does it. All right. Congratulations. Stick a fork in it. We're done. Mr. Sloosh Libre, competitive casual. The seven B the seven B big man. Shout out to all of our competitors tonight. Yes. We saw some new blood come out. I got to so catch a, a fledgling faces. raven. Yeah. You know, and, and the internet behaved itself. Like, by and large. I'm proud of you, internet. Yeah. You did good stuff, kid. There wasn't there wasn't like stuttering or hitching. I mean <laughs> Games take like 20 minutes to load, but that's just online Tekken. Well, other than the, you know, one or two times that the man cops came yeah. out and ruined it. Yeah. I can't wait for the PS5 to, to load uh, screens for Tekken 7 15 seconds faster. You know what? The PS5 is still going to basically allow you to, to take off all the controllers one at a time. Because who wants to do them all in one select all? Yeah, of course. I don't. I, I'm personally I waiting for the, uh, the $30 uh, USB multi-tap. Oh, isn't that spectacular? Oh, yeah. I wonder who in engineering approved that. It's like, you know what? On the front, 1A, 1C. They'll figure it out. Yeah, they'll <laughs> deal with it. They'll buy whatever we advertise. Pretty much. I I mean, I've already kind of resigned myself to, to no more computer upgrades this year, but I got to get that God of War 2 when it comes out. Ooh, that looks juicy. Yeah. Hella juicy. I'm super excited for that. That... Uh, Assassin's Creed. Uh, new I'm not, 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 not a really big good. Assassin's Creed fan anymore, but that's fine. Go off. Hey, there's that. Um, I'm I'm really big on Ghost of Tsushima right now. Oh, with yeah. the, the Legends expansion that just came out, and it's going to be very exciting. Come this Friday, um, October 30th, they're releasing finally the the long touted raid that they're going to do for the, the the Ghost of Tsushima Legends. So make sure you get all of your heroes of the four classes upgraded and uh get cracking in there if you even want to play that i'm on and I'll, i will more than happily slash some uh demons and tank goo and oni with you there you go folks you heard the man uh yeah uh find, find mr j and uh and friend him up but uh hey. let's go ahead and take a look at these brackets uh, so yeah, first place, competitive casual, not dropping a set tonight, 4-0 record. Artsy Nate coming in second with that 3-2, just edging out Subway Wang with his own 3-2. Uh, fourth place, Tigerzord92, Tiger. with a good costume selection. Uh, Medic tying for fifth place with Jay Digga. J Medic will probably see you back on Thursday for uh, Grand Blue Fantasy Versus. There we go. Yeah. Uh, Darkstorm Queen, first night out, manages to tie for seventh with Cracker Jack. Um, and then, uh, sadly for Munda Man, who uh, got the, the times mixed up due to, due to uh, time zone differentiation and uh, could not make it to the event. Oh, I didn't know Cracker Jack was in this. Shout out to Cracker oh, yeah. Jack. Cracker Jack was in there early. But, uh, yeah, there you go, folks. There's the, there's the whole thing in terms of win-losses. And it's not loading up the actual bracket bracket, but that's fine. <laughs> there we go. It's all nice and compact. So just a good small little showcase of yeah. some of the uh, Dude, the we, local talent we have here out in Ohio. We hit nine players. Ohio that's really Kentucky, great actually. For, for Tuesday Night Tech, and I'm proud of all of you. Hell yeah. I'm proud of you guys. Like, what what a good showing is all I can say to that. You guys came out and you guys played strong played strong but, uh, yeah I guess we'll go ahead and uh, cash it in for the night it's pretty late uh, but before we go just want to remind everybody that uh, we got GBVS coming up this Thursday on PC um, if, you, if you've not played it on PC it's, it's such a better performing game like in terms of online on that uh, very, very enjoyable. And if you come to this, you'll catch uh, some of the, the top Midwest players that uh, come by to slum it on my Dinky channel uh, when they're not like off winning regionals and crap. Uh, mm. uh, also, don't forget about Tatsunoko versus Corona. That's going to be coming up the end of November. Um, I'm sure sometime, like probably before, I want to say before Thanksgiving, although we haven't set a date just so. Uh, uh, we, we don't interfere with Thanksgiving travel. 
Uh, and do not forget about Dragon Punch. That is the All Ohio uh, tournament series happening every Saturday night at seven on our good friend Shaolin Pretzels channel. Uh, they've got your your Street Fighter, your Tekken Seven, your Mortal Kombat Eleven, Dragon Ball Fighters, and now they even have uh, KOF Two K Two and Footsies. Oh my God! Yeah. Solid lineup of games there. Absolutely. But that's going to do it for us tonight, guys. Thank you, everybody out there, for coming by and watching. If you thought we did a great job, leave us a follow. If you thought we did a great, great job, the subscription button is right there. And speaking of subscriptions, thank you to everybody who subscribed tonight or gifted subs. Night Blythe, in particular, gifting five subs. Uh, Sexy Blythe yeah. coming out with the daddy. Dr. Science coming through with a sub of his own. Uh, we had hosts from Cracker Jack. We had a new follower from Darkstorm Queen. Tiger Zord. Uh, all you guys are, are really helping keep the lights on here at Matchstick Melee, and we cannot express enough how much uh, we appreciate it. Please, please come out and support Matchstick Melee. This dude is keeping it together as far as uh, some of the locals and tournaments are concerned that we can host online. Yep. Um, he's really not keeping in the work in this time. <laughs> Definitely not emotionally, but yes, tournaments for sure. <laughs> No, we're going to stick to that. I'm yep. just saying. Um, but yeah, who knows? If uh, if this job thing actually starts doing well, then we might actually be able to start supporting uh, uh, the players themselves on our, on our yes, please, on Monday night event. Please send, your, uh, please send all of your spirit energy to Match Dick to get this job that he is on his second interview for. That's a big deal, folks. Yep. Send him your love and your spirit energy. Get him to J-O-B. Take it. Uh, is there a site for times? Yes, you can actually go to OhioFGC.com. Our good friend, Mr. Mistopheles, has uh, put up our entire schedule for the week. You can also see it uh, scrolling across your screen right now. Tuesday is our Soul Calibur slash Tekken 7 night. We alternate games every week, and then we also alternate formats uh, every two weeks. So next week will be uh, Soul Calibur 6 on PS4. And then we'll go back to Tekken 7 on PC and Soul Calibur 6 on PC and so on and so on in that fashion. Thursday nights, it's a uh, standard GBVS on PC because uh, it's the only copy we own. And uh, then, of course, Street Fighter is multi-platform, which, God, I hope there will be a, a that that's the future for all the games going down the going down the way. Um, uh, but yeah, uh, 9 p.m. every single one of these Eastern time zone. Um, with a check-in about 15 minutes beforehand. Uh, yep. Yeah. That is exactly it, Honeydew. We're yep. seeing a, a proliferation of online tournaments specifically because of the ways that COVID-19 have affected businesses, venues. Everything has been canceled. Okay. The prospect is, of having tournaments, even in the next year, is looking really bleak. Yeah, it's, it's just not looking like we're going to be going back to IRL anytime soon, uh, which, you know, breaks my heart because that'll mean, like, Two no combo breakers, two no combo cons, two no Yoma cons. Like oh. not even the, the the tournaments we've had here in the Columbus area that became you know majors like Raj. Yeah, true. I mean, Raj, the last one was amazing. It was well, unfortunately, the uh, the owner operator of, of Tokyo Tech uh, is not. Yeah, he quit, so Tokyo Tech doesn't exist. So Raj doesn't exist. Yeah, uh, yeah. So that that's a that's a big heavy hit for this big scene, big and it's not unique to many scenes where they've lost some of their major players because COVID-19 has just kind of stuck a, a fork into everything. Oh, yeah. Straight up sticking the, in the bike spoke. Um, but, yeah, we'll, we'll keep going as long as uh, people keep showing up. So, uh, you know, I guess I'll, all I can say is uh, get ready for the next battle. And uh, we'll see you guys out there on the interwebs. Uh, Have a good evening, folks. Yep. Take yep. care. Yep. Take care. Stay safe. Be excellent to each other. Just Thank you for having me on to talk and yap with you. Thank you for coming on. This has been a treat. Always a pleasure, King. You take care of yourself. Yep. Take it easy, Mr. J. And uh, yeah, yeah, bring bring that hot ass PC uh, to to the next uh, tournament. I will. I'm gonna have to probably talk to you about some uh, tech. Uh, off of this to try to get some optimization for it, but oh, for sure. we'll go to that at another point. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Until then, see you guys yeah, later. Time to go to bed. Night, everybody. Have a good one. <laughs>